What it do, what it do, what it do, you too. It's your boy Green Leaf Exclusive. Back at it with another Houston Rockets exclusive video. If you're new to the channel, make sure you guys hit that like button, subscribe. Hit that notification bell as well. We're going to keep rocking. We're going to keep grinding, man. Believe that. Believe that, man. But today, we have an early game. You know what I'm saying? Early awakening. The Cleveland Cavaliers, the 42 and 24 Cleveland Cavaliers, will make the second stop of their third game road trip against the Houston Rockets, 31-35, in the Toyota Center, man. Y'all get the likes up as you come on in the building, as you walk in the door, and we're going to grind, man. The Cleveland Cavaliers 1-0 against the Houston Rockets this season. Cleveland 135-130 to 130 in overtime, covering a four-point spread. as over the 215 cash uh, in December 18th. So if y'all on that money line, man, Y'all better pay attention to this game. And uh, also, you know, uh, Donovan Mitchell is back in the lineup, you know, so Cleveland will have some firepower. I believe there's no Evan Mobley and uh, it was somebody else. Who was it? Max Struess. Max Struess, who's out tonight. Uh, so, yeah, man. Uh, before, we get to the, before we get to the chat, I want to give a shout out to let me see who was that. Let me give a shout out to Maurice Walker in the PayPal, in the donations, man. He say good win. Appreciate the content uh, 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 on the last stream against the Washington Wizards, man. Hey, I appreciate the dono, man. I appreciate it, uh, Maurice. If you're listening, if you come across the stream, man, I appreciate the donation. And if all everybody else who hit the cash app, PayPal, the link will be posted in the comment section. Appreciate the super chats. Let me get a shout out to all the members of the channel. Divine Energy, J Dog, Todd, Alan Luna, Vic, Big Ready Man STL, Dre, Romeo, The Dot T Wheel, Red Lobo, JR Bennett, Zachary Sand, Chico, Shooter TV, Laro, Jehovah Sand, Miss Rhonda, uh, Miss Rhonda Flores, and the homie Mike Williams. And I appreciate y'all for showing love to the channel. Appreciate it. Once again, the Cleveland Cavaliers and the Houston Rockets. Uh, let me see who in the building, man. Let's see who in the building, man. 
That's who the Ready Rock got. The homie Zach are in the building. What up, Zach? Salute. General salute, Zach. Salute, salute, man. Salute, homie. Tyler Brown, what it do? What it do, Tyler? What's good with you, homie? Mike Williams, say salute, Greenleaf, and chat. Hit that like button as you come on in, man. Hit that like button as y'all walk on in the door. My mic is right. Let me know in the chat. Press one if I'm too loud. Or if I'm too low, if I'm too low, let me know. Salute, 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 Mike. There she go. What is up, Miss Rhonda? Miss Rhonda Flores in the building. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Yes, ma'am. Zap Ops, what it do, Zap? Salute, salute, man. Sniper in the building. What up, Sniper? He says, salute, gotta bring early. Facts. What up, Alex? Salute, salute, Alex. Ivan, what's up, Ivan? Ivan said, I'm in the building, Green Lee, and ready to lock in uh, with you in the chat, man. Hey, let's get it today, bro. Let's get it, man. Salute to you, bro. Salute to you. Steve Seven in the B. Steve Seven, what's happening? He said, think Jalen gonna go off, bro, bro. And I, I, it should be one of them games, man. I want to see Jalen Green really compete against these two guards. You know, we got contracts, talks that we've been having, discussions that we've been having about Jalen Green. So these are one of these matchups that you're going to get that sample size from Jalen. No LP, so he's basically the show. But at the end of the day, it's a team effort. So I do believe Jalen should go off. I want him to go off. But is he? We shall see. Uh, we shall see, famo. We shall see. Thelma Smith in the building. What up, Thelma? Thelma, salute, salute. He say Jalen going out. Man, I hope he do. I hope he do. I always want Jalen to go out. You know? I always want Jalen to come out and have a good game. But yeah, man, y'all hit the like button, man. I mean, how many likes we sitting on off the rip? How many likes we have right now? 15 likes, 10 people ain't hit the like button. So yeah, from off. Finna get to it. Finna lift off, finna take off. No pun intended. And let's get it, man. Let's get it. So in the starting lineup for the Houston Rockets. The same old lineup. Jabari Smith Jr., Jalen Green. I, uh, I was about to say LP. <laughs> Fred Van Vliet. Uh Armin Thompson and Dylan Brooks. You got Isaac O'Coral, George Niang, Jared Allen, Darius Garland, and Donovan Mitchell. Start the lineup tonight for the uh, Cleveland Cavaliers. And Cleveland been, you know what I'm saying, balling too. Cleveland been balling. They've been handling business. This is one of these teams. I know we've been getting away with murder with these other teams. You know, uh, that's not really, you know, in the winning situation. And we trying to creep up in that play. And so, this is one of those games that you really want to analyze and size up and really want these dudes to really, you know, go 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 straight full fledged in on email your Doka system. The defense being turned up, the switch has been crazy. You know, uh the offense, it is what it is with the offense. We're still young, we still need to knock down some shots. But Fred Van Vliet, Jalen Green, you know, uh, and other guys have been trying to step up in the right ways. Armin Thompson as well, the 20 and 10 game that he had. Uh just want to see them keep that energy alive, man. What up, Allen? Salute, salute, Allen Luna in the building. Let's rock out, family. Let's rock out, family. The Prince, what's popping? What's what's popping? The print. What's up with it? The print. Big shot bar. He say salute, salute to the chat, salute, homie, salute. Allen, what it do? Y'all get the likes up, man. Get the likes up. Get the likes up. Let's get more people in the building, man. We're gonna have some fun today. Hope everybody chilling, relaxing with the family. If you at work, listen to the homie. I got you. I got you. You know your boy Greenleaf got you, man. Salute to the people. Salute to the fam. He said it's a playoff game. Salute, Andrew. Laro in the building. What up, Laro? Salute to Laro in the building. Salute. Salute. Big Steve right behind. What up, Big Steve? Big Steve up in this thing. Chris Strange TV. I see you. I see you. <laughs> Deion Waiters. Yeah, man. So here we go, man. I'm pull up this box score. and I'm set it up real quick. And uh, we're going to get to it, man. We're going to get to it. So here we go. Jared Allen with it. And Dylan Brooks off the rip with a steal. Jalen Green to the rack. Gives up to Jabari Smith Jr. with the slam. Hey, there you go, Jabari, like we've been talking about. Donk it. 
Don't go up south and Timmy. We want you to we want to see you punch the rim. They're gonna go up with you, break they thought, break they break their wrist. You know what I'm saying? 2-0 lead for the Houston Rockets. It's Donovan Mitchell with the rock. Pulls up for a three, and that's a bucket. Bucket for uh, uh Donovan Mitchell. Buckets for Donovan. 3-2 game. Jalen Green gives it up to Fred Van Vliet. To Fred Van Vliet, Jabari. All wants a turnover by Houston. But yeah, Jalen to Jabari came down and punched the rim. Came down and punched the rim, bro. Hold on, man. Dylan Brooks with the step back three. Bangers. Bangers for Dylan Brooks. Dylan the villain. 5 3 game. Here comes Garland. Garland up top with it. Garland. Looking for Jerry Allen. He has the mismatch with Fred Van Vliet. No post move. Got caught up. Stripped up. Stolen by Fred. He ain't got no post moves. He ain't got no post moves. Jalen Green wide open for a three. Can he hit it? Buckets. There we go. We starting off the right way. We starting off the right way. 8 3 game. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Donovan Mitchell with it. Off the screen with the in and out. Good strip. Good strip by Jabari. He recovers on the rebound. He gives up the Garland. Garland with the, uh-oh. We got, we got hogs everywhere on that perimeter. We got hogs everywhere. We're going to make it tough for you, Garland. Kick it out to the three. A core for three. Buckets. They trade the three. A five game. A six game. Sorry about this. Fred Van Vliet pulls up for a quick shot. He missed it. Armin Thompson recovers the rebound. Jalen with the, with the re to the rack. Jalen. Pulls up for the mid-range shot. Buckets. Jalen Green starting off hot. Five points for Jalen Green. 10-6 game. 10-6 game. As Donovan Mitchell with the drive goes up, kicks it out to Okoro again for a three. He missed it this time. Rebound by Jabari. Oh, no. Saved by Jalen Green. Jalen. Straight down the middle. Jalen Green goes up and finger rolls it. Missed it. He missed the finger roll. It's Garland. He's pushing the pace. Kicks it out. Donovan Mitchell would have catch a shoot three from the corner. Buckets. Oh, yeah. It's one of them days, man. It's one of them days, dog. Coming up. Hey, Dylan Brooks getting big. Turn around. Jump shot. Fatal for Dylan. He missed it. Rebound by Cleveland. Donovan Mitchell with it. Slowly walking it up. He kicks it ahead to a Okoro. Okoro to Jerry Allen. He going straight to the right. He lost it, but they call a foul on the floor on Fred Van Vliet. 10-9 ball game on my end. Smash the like button. Subscribe to the channel if you're new. Salute to everybody's in the building. What up? What up, chat? Alan Luna in the building. Alan Luna. Mike Brown, what it do, Mike? What up? What up, dog? My boy Red Lobo. What's happening, Red Lobo? Salute, salute. That Texas shit, man. His knee ain't goes to the back basket. Man, how this dude get a bucket? How he get a bucket? How he do that? As the bar swinging it to Dylan Brooks. Dylan Brooks with the pump fake. Dylan Brooks to Alman Thompson with the two-hand slam. Yes, sir. Rockets take the lead back by one. 12 to 11 ball game. 840 to go in the first quarter. Smash the like button. Subscribe to the channel. If you want to donate to the channel, hit the cash up. PayPal. The link will be posted in the comment section. Salute to everybody that support the channel. We need this dub, bro. Let's, we got to make it tough for uh, Cleveland. We have to make it tough for Cleveland. That's Garland on the on the perimeter, trying to get busy on Jabari Smith with the heads. He goes up, and he gets the layup to go. That's Garland. Look like he twisted something, but he got the layup to go. They take the lead back by one. 13-12 game. Jalen Green off the screen. Jalen Green to the rack gets bumped. Goes against. Jerry Allen gets his own rebound, kicks it out to the three, swinging it. Dylan Brooks with the pump fake jab step. Dylan pulls up for a three anyway. Buckets. Dylan feeling some type of way. Dylan feeling some type of way, man. Dylan Brooks hitting on all cylinders. Two for two from the three with six points. As knee ain't give up to Jerry Allen in the post. Gets bumped by Dylan Brooks, and he gets the layup to go anyway. 15-type ball game. Armin Thompson looking for Jabari. Gives it up to Jalen. Jalen one-on-one, -on -one, swinging it to Jabari. Jabari one-on-one -on -one with Jared Allen. Step back. Ah, too predictable. Jabari stolen by Jared, I mean, uh, by Darius Garland. He pulls the trigger from three. Too strong. Rebound by Jalen. He throws it ahead. Dylan Brooks 
Dylan to the rack, goes up, left hand scoop, missed it, tipped up, rebound by Armand Thompson. He goes up, no foul call, got his rebound back, don't give up. Play is good. 17 15, Rockets take the lead back by two. 7 20 left to go in the first. Garland, man, they left him wide open for three. He missed it. Hawked down by Fred Van Vliet. Fred straight to the basket. Fred goes up, left hand shot. Missed the layup. He got the rebound. Fred. Back to Jabbar. Jabbar with the step back. That's money. Buckets. Splash it. Cash it. Get that man his cash, dog. Jabbar with the bucket. 19-15. Let's lock in on defense, man. Let's lock in on D. And we have a foul on Armin Thompson on Donovan Mitchell. And we have a timeout on the court, man. Timeout on the court. Salute to everybody in the building. What's up with it, my people? What's up with it, my people? Jabbar Smith Jr. with four points. Armin Thompson with four. Dylan Brooks with six points. Two for two from the three. Uh, Fred Van Vliet, 0 for 2 from the field, zero points yet, four assists, uh, and three rebounds for Fred. One block. Uh, Jalen Green, 2 for 4 from the field with five points to lead the uh, – him and Dylan Brooks leading the uh, uh, starters. So the Rockets shooting 53% from the field, 75% from the three. One turnover for Houston, nine rebounds and six assists for the team. The – Cleveland Cavaliers, 60% shooting overall from the field, 50% from the three, three for six shooting for Cleveland. Uh, one turnover, three assists, two rebounds. Niang in the start lineup with two points. You have uh, Okoro with three, Jared Allen with two points, Darius Garland with two, two assists, and Donovan Mitchell with six points to start this first quarter. Rockets lead by four. Uh, let me see. What's up, Osavado? Osavado. What's happening? Divine Energy, what's good? Salute to you. He said it looked like Jalen got to push it, pushing it back on the layup. Yeah, man. I mean, it's gonna it's gonna continuously be tough for Jalen, but you know, he need them, he need them type of, you know, none calls at times to make him stay aggressive, you know, keep him staying aggressive and having a chip on the shoulders of trying to get that call. You know, hopefully it'll turn around from uh it'll turn around, you know. B Steve say we have uh, we have a sense of urgency without the current lineup. With this current lineup. Yeah, it's a bunch of athletic guards, athletic bodies running around, Big Steve, you know. Uh especially if you move Jabbar to the five without Alpi's absence. Uh not saying LP slows us down, but we play a certain type of level. But with all these dudes just running and gunning, of course, of course we're gonna look, you know, like a fast break team. We play fast. The switch is going to be more lethal. You know, everybody can switch up. You seen Fred get switched on Jerry Allen and stole it right up on his, uh, 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 when he put the ball on the floor, he stole it from him. So it's a different lineup, a different shape up when it comes to the Rockets defense. And Ime Doka, we know that's what he's known for. You know? Zap, I say 50 views on the 27 likes, man. Come on, get the likes up, bro. Let's get over 100 people in the building, man. Y'all got to hit that like button, man. I'm up here. I'm doing my thing. Let's get the likes up, man. Playing our hopes is still, it's still a go. Just got to keep winning. We got to keep winning, man. Gonna get back to it. So here comes uh, Donovan Mitchell with a catch and shoot three. That's way out. Way out. Air ball three for Donovan Mitchell. 19 to 15 for the Houston Rockets. 6.37 to go in the first quarter. Here comes Fred Van Vliet. Fred walking it up. Fred off the screen. Fred with the heads. He gives up to Jabari for three. Oh, and that's a missed shot. Good shot. Just missed it. Fortunately, here comes Levin. Uh, who's that? Oh, Levert. Cash Levert with the draw. He goes up and he gets the layup to go. He gets the layup to go on Jalen Green. We have a 19 to 17 ball game now. It's Jabari Smith with it. Jabari with the one on one gives up to Jalen Green. Jalen off the screen by Jabari. 
pulls up for the three. Too short. Jared Allen with the rebound. Gives up to Donovan Mitchell. Niang. Back to Okoro. Back to Niang. To Donovan Mitchell. Guarded by Uncle Jeff. He takes the miss. In and out. Donovan Mitchell. Get busy. Left, the layup is good. The layup is good. How the hell did he hit that? How the hell did knee ain't hit that? 22 to 21. Jabbar to, to the rack. To Dylan Brooks. Dylan Brooks to the rack. Turn around jump shot for Dylan. It goes in. Dylan Brooks starting the game a very aggressive. 23 to 22. 445 to go in the fourth in the first quarter. In and out by Donovan Mitchell. He steps back, pulls up for 17. That's a miss. Rebound by Jalen. Jalen with the push. Jalen straight down the middle. Goes up. He gets fouled. And if he would have finished that shot, bro. If Jalen would have finished that shot, bro, we would have. We need my all our points. Let's cash in at the free throw line. So let me see about these stats. Uh And he missed the first free throw, man. Lord have mercy. Lord have mercy. Come on, man. We got to make these free throws. Second one is good. So Dylan Brooks with eight points and Jalen with six. Jabari and Armin Thompson with four points apiece. Rockets lead by two. Garland with the rock, one on one with Uncle Jeff. Garland swinging it. Okoro, he drives. Good defense by Houston. Okoro goes up. Good defense by Jalen Green with the block. The Armour Thompson rubbing off on the swing pass. Dylan Brook left open for a corner three. Oh, and it's a no go. Jot Landale in the building can't get the rebound. Garland with it. Garland on the mission. One on one with Fred Van Vliet. Shoot. Hey, yeah. Thank you. Thank you, real. Thank you, real. God damn. You gonna run my nigga over? He's gonna run my nigga over, huh? Good defense by Jalen right there, though, man. He tried to use your, his muscle. You use your athleticism. 24 to 22. Jalen with the drive going to the rack. And save Uncle Jeff for three. And it rattles out. Cleveland with the rebound. Garland pushing it. Garland one-on-one -on -one with Fred Van Vliet once again. Garland to the wreck with the heads. It goes over with a high floater. Buckets. Top ball game. Top ball game. And we have a jump ball on the play. Jump ball on the play. 319 to go in the first quarter on my end. Top ball game. Top ball game. We have a jump ball against Jalen Green in a, a car row. Hey, Laro, how much you got the Rockets losing by? How much you got the, the Rockets losing by? Hey, I thought Christian, Christian, Trishna Thompson was expanding for using PEDs, bro. Anyway, anyway, 24-24, Okoro swinging it to Levert, back to Okoro, straight line three for Okoro, that's a no-go, rebound by Christian Tristan Thompson, Tristan to Levert, he missed the layup, Rockets can't get the goddamn rebound, that's Fred Van Vliet snagged the rebound, 
Fred with the push. We still in the first quarter, 240 to go. Dylan Brooks goes up. Left hand layup is good for Dylan. The veteran connection. The veteran connection. Fred to Dylan. Now we got to get a stop. 26 to 24. Let's see this top 10 defense all year, man. Even still, we still we still top 10. Garland with the with the step back three. Pull up. That's an in and out. Rebounded by Cleveland. They get it. Lavert on top of the key, guarded by Dylan Brooks. He drives to the rack. Good defense by Houston. Jock Land. Oh, we turned it over, bro. Let's slow the down, bro. Can we slow down one time? Can we please slow down? Man, let me calm down real quick, man. <laughs> let me calm down, man. You say chill. Nah, I'll let her, I know you. I know you be trying to make your money on the back end of the losses and shit, so you can't fool me, dog. You can't fool me. Hey, hey, Divine, man, I thought Tristan Thompson was suspended or something. He's using PEDs and stuff, bro. What's up with that, man? Why he ain't trying to retire? Get your ass up out of here, dog. <laughs> you over with, bro. Niggas on ESPN went back to the Lakers. Went, went play for the Lakers. I was wondering why he was had so much energy, energy than Anthony Davis in the Western Conference. I was like, this nigga come out here breaking no sweat, but he got the same amount of energy. Nah, you on something, bro? You on something? Somebody done put you on, Tristan? Who put you on a, on on type of uh, you know what I'm saying? Elixirs. I'm just saying, dog. He said like child support. <laughs> child support got him got him uh uh grinding for that bag, huh? Man, I'll take the veterans minimum. I'll take below a veterans minimum. I'll take a below a veterans minimum. I just need some type of income. <laughs> hey man, let me stop playing with that man like that, bro. Fuck him. That nigga simp too. <laughs> Y'all say LeBron Tyler. Brian taught that man some 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 things to furthermore his endurance. Cause he trash, bro. He been trash, really. Like, like Tristan, come on, man. Just it's too many young brothers out there that need to have your same job that can just rebound and do the and and make awkward ass, ugly ass free throw shots, bro. It's all you good for. Jot Landale is better than you, Tristan Wood. Chris Tristan Thompson. Jot Landale is better than you, bro. Anyway, man. All right, we finna get back to it. Still in the first quarter. Y'all get the likes up. 26 to 24. Under two minutes to go. Jalen Green gets it. Jalen Green with the step back pulls the trigger from three. Buckets. Jalen on one. Jalen on one. Yeah, he on one, Allen. Jalen Green take over. He on one, man. What up, Stephen Harris? I see you, bro. I see you. Make sure y'all hit the like button as y'all come on in, man. It's Tristan Thompson. Gives it up to Levert. Levert with the parfait driving left. Nowhere to go. Gives it up. On top of the key to, to the homeboy. They shoot the three. Oh, we want him to shoot, but we can't have him rebounded. Rockets. Playing defense. We have a 29 to 24 ball game. Alley you, and we have a foul on Houston. We have a foul on Houston. So Jalen right now. Well, the Houston Rockets right now, Dylan Brooks leading the pack with 10 points. 
Dylan Brooks leading the pack with 10 points, two for three from the three, four for eight from the field. And you have Jalen Green with nine points, three for six from the field, two for three as well from the three. As Cleveland, Levert with the pump fake. Man, he keep doing the same move to look pump fake, bro. He not finna shoot no threes. Might well back up off him. Jalen controlling the show. Up by three, Houston. Jalen off the screen, step back for another three. Jalen with the trigger. Buckets. Oh, my goodness. Hey, man. Boy, heating up. The boy trying to heat up. He trying to heat up. Nigga. Six-point game. Garland, he got rock with it. But he got fouled. Yo, Jalen, wake up, dog. It's your world now, man. It's your world now, dog. Can't take the back seat because LP out there. You got to show up more than, than the team needs you even more. Y'all trying to go somewhere, huh? These Every game is meaningful. We got to slap the shit out of all these teams that come around now. Ain't no playing no games. So you got to wake up, bro. Because you got you going to have, you know what I'm saying, your number one fans, that, that, like Laro. Uh, you know, that 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 fake the front like they'll cut for the homie, you know what I'm saying? Jalen Green again. At least, <laughs> that nigga Jalen saying they got about to duck on your bitch ass, Tristan. <laughs> he said, I'm about to duck on your 3227, man. 3227 in the first quarter. Jalen Green one on one, driving. Got bumped by Christian Tristan Thompson. <laughs> yeah, you know what's coming. You know you try. I'm gonna hawk you down and foul you. Yeah, and I know, I know. Finna sit your, finna sit your old ass on the bench. You cheating ass nigga, on and off the court. That's your character. You a cheater. Tristan Thompson, man. It's a... And what they say, birds of a fail to flock together. So I know who you hang around with too, nigga. Cheating. But we're hanging about a bunch of cheaters of the game and try to get away with the shit. Man, oh man, oh man. I'm preaching today. It ain't even Sunday. Dylan Brooks. Give the goddamn rock up, dog. Stop all this casual ass over dribbling, bro. Please. Please stop all this over dribbling, Dylan Brooks. We could have had another good shot on a fast break. You not like that, bro. You not like that, Dylan. Stop it, man. Stop it. Stop, Dylan. Straight up. 
horrible ass position at the end of the game. Gave him free throws and all kind of shit. How you give up a position and then give up give up numbers two at the same goddamn time? You turn the ball over and you give them points. That's that clown shit sometimes dealing Bruce. We be talking about, bro. Like you, 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 you playing good up to the to that point. I seen it come. I see when you get a little, little out of character. I just sit back all season like, man, this nigga here, bro. Here we go. Here come Dylan Brooks with this foot. He getting a little too an antsy. He got a little, he got them little goddamn fire ants in his pants right now. He getting a little too hyper. Nigga, just do your job and let the, let the guards dribble. You just run the wing. Cut. Play defense. Do that. Spot up for a three and all that, bro. Like, all that extra shit, stop it, dog. Real talk. Real talk, Dylan. At least you, boy, boy, at least I would give Dylan Bruce this. He ain't kick nobody in the nuts. He ain't, he ain't holding niggas nuts and doing all that other weirdo shit, you know what I'm saying, to jeopardize and gets tossed up out the game like he did early in the season, in the preseason, then a, uh, a couple of weeks into the, into the NBA season. Like he been he been cool, you know, laid back. He'll he'll do some little fuckery shit as far as like turning the ball over, doing some dumb shit like he Kobe. But other than that, you know, I, I took my cap to him. You know, he 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 been all right. He been solid as far as defensively and actually getting paid to what he's supposed to be doing. He do what he's supposed to get paid to do. Don't let Dylan run the ball. Hey, that's what I'm talking about. Don't let him do it. Don't do it, nigga. At all. You got too many wing 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 guys that can control the show on a fast break. We don't need you making no dumbass plays like that. Uh, and then giving up and then following him, giving up two more 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 free throws. Like calm down one time, Dylan. Calm down, dog. Calm down. You still hooping right now, though. You still hooping. So let's get back to it, man. We got over. Man, come on, man. Let's get the lights up, man. Let's get the lights up. We back at it. Got Aaron Holiday in action. Oh, my God. Reggie Bullethead in the building. Reggie Bullethead getting some rep. Jay Sean Tate, Reggie Bullet, Holiday, Uncle Jeff, and Jabari Smith Jr. It's finna be tough. Holiday gives up the bullet. He drives off the screen, bounce past the Uncle Jeff, corner three. But Jay Sean Tate with the par fight, Tate with the Euro gets fouled. There we go, Tate. Just stay aggressive. If we stay aggressive, we good, though. We stay aggressive. Hey, Reggie Bullet, you can take this shit off your head, bro. Look like you ain't watched this shit in, 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 in years. Yeah, my brother got dreads, nigga. I know what it's supposed to look like. You you make millions off the bench. You ain't supposed to look like that, dog. That's why I call you Reggie Bullethead. Here we go, man. We have a 35-29 game, man. Let me get back to the play-by-play. -play. Salute to everybody still in the building. Niang with it up top. Niang. Give it up to Garland. Garland. One-on-one -on -one holiday. Niang driving. Nowhere to go. You too sloppy to move past the bar. Niang. Threes up for Cleveland. Missed shot. Rebound by Jason Tate. J Jason. Driving. Bat out of hell. Goes left. Bucket is good for Jason Tate. <laughs> Jason Tate. He says it's his birthday, Laro. Uh, all right, then. Niang with the palm fake. Once again, one on one with Jabari. Niang. Oh, get stolen by Jabari. Jabari, good defense. Look at, look at, look at, look at, look at, look at Tristan. Jeff Green, the Reggie Bullet. They give it back to Tate. Tate. Big boy him, Tate. Swing pass to Jabbar. Jabbar to the rack. Goes up. Sloppy. Got it blocked, bro. Come on, Jabbar. Come on, Jabbar. Pull up for Niang. Splashes. Splashing it. Niang with the three. This sloppy roast fucking pulled pork looking ass built dude cashing in for the three. This is crazy. Uncle Jeff back at you, nigga. Uncle Jeff, three to the dome. Uncle Jeff, three to the rock. Five 
40 40 32 Rockets still lead by eight. Rockets still lead by eight. Levert, Niang with the pump fake. Niang to the rack. He he should not be getting to the basket, bro. He should not be getting to the basket at all. I don't give a damn how he built. He can't be getting to the basket like that. I mean, but at the same time, man, a hooper is a hooper. That's all I got to say. A hooper is a hooper. Look at this dude. <laughs> Boy, built like a sloppy Joe. Pull up. Bucket is good. Thirty-three to forty. Only ten minutes left to go in the second quarter. Niang gets the bucket to go. Come on, Rockets, let's lock in. Yeah, he a plumber for real. That plumber off of Morton. What's that plumber off of Morton? Pull up for Jabari. Got it. Cash it. Buckets, man. Count it, dog. Get that boy's bread. You know what I'm saying? We eating over here. 43-34. Rockets lead by nine. Garland with it one-on-one. -on -one. Garland one-on-one -on -one off the screen. What the hell was that? And we have a blocking. Whoa, 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 he caused that shit, dog. Well, he caused that turnover. That's good defense. What the fuck? Wow. Bro, that's a charge, if nothing. Pull up three for Garland. Too short. Tipped up in the rebound by Holiday. He gives up to Jason and Tate. It's a three. It's a one on three. Tate going to the rack. Strong. Buckets, Tate. Call that shit too, real. Call that shit too. What you talking about? 11 point game. Pull up three. Buckets. Pull up three by House. Here comes Holiday. Holiday driving. Oh, that's easy. Oh, he swing it. Corner three. Tate, you got to knock that bitch down, Tate. Oh, he missed it. Jabari with the rebound. Jabari going strong, nigga. He give it back to Tate. Tate pull up for another three. This time is good. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Back to 11-point game. 48-37, nigga. We're going to trade buckets. We're going to trade buckets. 8.30 left to go in the second. Swing pass. Niang with it. Niang. I don't know how he keep getting to the basket. It's Tate's Jason Tate took his cookies. Man, take that dude lunch money, man. Take his lunch money, man. He don't deserve it. He ain't finna do nothing with it. Holiday between the legs. Holiday pulls up trigger from three. That's a miss, Bob. Baby, they finna shut it down tonight. It's Garland jogging it up. Garland with the drive, swinging it. Levert. He missed the three. Rebound by Reggie Bullet. Jabari with the push. Jabari to the rack. Jabari goes up. Finger rolls it. No foul call for Jabari. Missed the layup, man. Missed the layup. As Tristan Thompson gets it, he almost missed the dunk. Without them PEDs, he could have got hung. Time out on the court, man. Time out on the court. 48 to 39, man. So he's the lead by nine right now. Let me read these stats. We're going to take a quick timeout break. Jabari Smith Jr., seven points. Four points for Armin Thompson. Ten points for Dylan Brooks. 14 points for Jalen Green. Off the bench, five points for Uncle Jeff. Eight points for Jason Tate. Off the rip. The Rockets shoot 52% from the field, 53% from the three, only three turnovers. The Cavs, 46% shooting from the field, 37% from the three, five turnovers. In the start lineup, 10 points for Niang, eight points for Mitchell, five points for Garland. So, yeah, man, we have a timeout on the court. Houston lead by nine.
Oh, we back, we back, we back, we back. We got Jock Landale, Fred Van Vliet with it. Fred back to uh, Rockets with the turnover, 48-39. A coral to the rack. He missed the layup. He blew it. He blew the layup. Take to Fred to Reggie Bullet with the pump fake. Come on, Reggie. Okay, Reggie. Let's go, Reggie. Let's go, Reggie. Reggie Bullet head, man. Making something happen. 5139. I will pay you two mil for nigga. Levert. Off the drive. He going to the rack. Levert. Like a bat out of hell, just doing anything. 51-41. Rockets with the 10-point lead. It's Fred Van Vliet to the to the rack. Gives up Jock Landell. No hesitation for three. Jock with the miss. Jabari with the rebound. Jabari getting big. Jabari goes. There you go, Jabari. Be aggressive, nigga. Be aggressive, Jabari. Straight up. Come on, man. Stop being timid, dog. You got too much potential to be like that, man. 53-41, man. On my end. Donovan Mitchell to Levert. Man, what you finna do? Levert driving. Nowhere to go. Oh, he gets the bucket. Okay, Levert. Here come Rockies. Back to a 10-point game. We trading buckets. Fred Van Vliet with the step back. In and out on, on the homie. Bounce pass to Jot Landell. Jot Landell goes up. I told you he better than Tristan Thompson, punk ass. I told you uh, Jot Landell better than uh, 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 Tristan. 55-43, bro. We not playing. Not playing. They thought they thought this Rockets team was going to be in shambles. Oh, they got twin towers. They got twin towers. Look, 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 look at shit. Jerry Allen, all of a sudden, the light's too bright for his ass. You already know how he built. The light's be too bright for him. They got to do is punk him. Like he made you do say, bro. Ain't no way in hell these teams should be coming out here punking us and doing all this other stuff, bro. None of them. You embody your coach. You come out there with the same mentality, the same energy as your coach. Straight up. So, yeah. 55-43. Donovan Mitchell, turnover. Jalen Green with the rock. Jalen Green with it. Back to home at Thompson with the two hand style. We too fast for him. We too easy. It's too easy at Tom. It's too easy. It's too easy, man. 57 43. 5.30 in, in a second. Donovan Mitchell once again got about Army. You know he ain't finna do no with it. Look, picked up his dribble. Give it back to him. Armor still there. Armor with the defense. Donovan Mitchell trying to figure something out. He he desperate. He pulls up for the three. Buckets. Buckets for Donovan Mitchell. 57 46. 11 point game. Here comes Jalen Green. Jalen. Gives up the Jock Landale. Back to uh, Fred Van Vliet. Fred. Fred driving. Fred causing all kinds of shit. Stop, turn around, jump shot. Buckets. Buckets. Can he play defense too? Where you at, Donovan? We know he can score. Donovan Mitchell off the screen. Tipped out by Fred. Ooh, good defense, man. Hey, we ain't playing on that defense, bro. Houston Rockets is not playing on that defense, dog, at all. And we're going to run on your ass. We finna run up. We ain't scared of y'all like that. We, we finna run up and pull up, bro. Let's get over 75 five likes, man. Y'all stop playing with the numbers. It's Jock Landale foul, Jared Allen. The lights too bright for Mr. Mr. Two Lights is bright for him. Jared Allen. 59-46, bro. He going to the free throw line for two. Mm-hmm. First free throw is good for Jared. Makes both free throws. <clears throat> you see, it comes Fred Van, Fred Van Vliet. Fred gives up to Dylan Brooks to Jock Landale. Now they got a zone. They got a zone inside, huh? Here we go. Jock Landale with another three. Second free. Second three is a no go. Here come on, Coro. Rockets. 11 point game. 
Um, Thompson with hell of fire defense on Donovan Mitchell. They give it up to Gar Darius Garland. Back to Donovan Mitchell. Swing it to a Coro. He drops to the rack. Goes up. Bucket is good for a Coro in the paint. Rockets down by nine. It's a 59-50 to 50 game, man. Four minutes left to go in the second quarter. Jada Green controlling the pace. Gives it up to Fred Van Vliet. Fred with the catch to shoot for three. That's a miss off the back of the rim. Rebound by the homie. He gives it up to Donovan Mitchell. Mitchell. Allen with it. Donovan Mitchell with a catch and shoot. Off the back iron, missed it. Rebounded by Houston. Fred, swinging the head. Guess who ahead? Armin Thompson. He already leaking. Tom, Armin Thompson leaking the head already. 61-50. 61-50, Armin Thompson with eight points, man. Four for five from the field. Jabari, nine points, four for seven from the field. Jalen Green with 14. Dylan Brooks with 10. Fred only two points, but he has nine assists. Jared Allen gives up to Garland. Garland. To Allen. Allen goes over Statue of Liberty dunk. 61 to 52. 61 to 52. Jaden Green back with it. He pulls up a catch to shoot three. And it rattles out the rim. Three for five from the three for Jalen. Four for eight from the field overall. Garland with it. Gives it up. Pump fake. They give it back to Garland. Garland pulls up for a three. And they call an offensive foul on Jared Allen. Offensive foul on Jared, man. How many likes we sitting on, people? And again, man, if you want to donate to the channel, the link is in the comment section. Cash out, PayPal, all that. However you want to show some love, you want to hit the Super Chat. The Super Chat is open. If you want to become a member of the channel, the membership is open as well. Uh, and be a, be a part of the Greenleaf exclusive family. So we have a 62 to 58, 52 game. Jabari Smith Jr. with nine points. Armin Thompson with eight points. Dylan Brooks with 10 points in this game, four for eight shooting. Fred Van Vliet, like I said, two points, nine assists for Fred. Jalen Green with 14 points, six rebounds, and two assists. Off the bench, five points for Uncle Jeff, three points for Reggie Bullet. Jason Tate with eight points in seven minutes. Uh, the Rockets shooting 54% from the field, 45% from the three, four turnovers for Houston, man, which is a good thing, man. You would think the Rockets would be turning it over, but I, I don't think that the Cleveland Cavaliers perimeter defense can't match our defense, man. It can't match it. It can't match it at all. Like I like JB Bickerstaff, and I I know I love what he's doing out there in the East with this with this young Cavs team. But at the same time, he made Doka. He a different animal when it comes to defensive presence. He's a different animal when it comes to defensive coaching. Like I said, I love J.B. Bickerstaff, but Ime Yadoka is a different animal. And I don't think they have the right the right type of perimeter guys that's going to lock in on defense like we do. And we're a younger team. You know? So, by that being said, for the Cleveland Cavaliers, they have eight points by Levert off the bench, 11 points for Donovan Mitchell, 10 points for Nia. And compared to our starters, 10 points for Dylan Brooks, 14 points for uh, Jalen Green and nine points for Jabari Smith Jr. And it seems like Jabari Smith Jr. kind of seems like he's uh, having a bad game. It's always quiet for Jabari, but guess what? He's a plus 12, leading the whole starting five and plus minus right now. So his impact on his team right now is hella five. It's hella five for Jabari right now with the nine points. He's a plus 12 right now, one for two from the three. So he's not shot, Jackie. He only took two threes, 50%. And he's four for seven. Now, I do need to see more rebounds because Fred Van Vliet right now is our rebounder, Jabari Smith Jr. Uh, but that comes with, you know, uh, going to the locker room and, you know, Ime Yudoka actually, you know, uh, letting these boys be aware of themselves about what they need to be do doing as far as their production. But like I said, he's a plus 12 leading the way, so his impact is still a big present for this uh, Houston Rockets team. We're going to get back to the action. Make sure you guys do not hit, forget to hit the like button and keep subscribing to the channel. Appreciate all the new subscribers that's hitting the subscribe button tonight, today, shall I say. And we're going to keep going, man. We're going to keep going. Y'all stay tuned for the halftime show because I know the homies going to pull up and, uh, and you know what I'm saying, give them a good show at the halftime show. What up, Allen? Oh! <laughs> Armin Thompson. Oh, my goodness. Oh, my God. Lord, Jesus, Mary, and Joseph. Oh my God, bruh. Oh man, oh man, oh man. Replay that shit. 
own, own, own Jerry Allen. Get your punk ass out of here, bro. I'm 6 m nigga. Get up out of my face. Real talk. Get up out of here. Jabari with the catch and shoot for three. Man, get up out of there, man. It's over, nigga. Yeah. You own one, Jabari. 12 points, five for eight. They thought we couldn't escape. They thought we weren't going to escape this shit. Yeah. I told y'all believe, man. Believe in your boy Greenlee. Blame, believe in these Rockies. I don't give a damn what, it, what the story may be. And Jerry Allen goes over the left hand, left hand layup, and it's good. Facts, Miss V. Shout out to Miss V. I facts, Miss V. Jalen Green, jab step. And, yep, yep. Get them in foul trouble, Jalen. Use your athleticism, dude. Come on, man. Come on, man. Bro, this boy Armin Thompson punched that dude. He punched him. Fred. Going to the rack. Alley -oop. Boom, nigga. Let's go. Let's go, nigga. Yeah, Fred. It's a 14-point game, bro. Boy, did hey, hey, Fred got 11 assists. He don't give a damn about scoring. His threes don't mean a goddamn thing, nigga. We're gonna, we gonna break these boys down to the crumbs. We're gonna break them to the crumbs. Look, another rebound. Jalen pushing it. Jalen off the screen. Look, they got a foul and shit. Swinging it. Fred. Bounce pass on the top. So guess what? I'm going to dunk this bitch. I'm going to dunk that motherfucker, nigga. Nigga. 7 and 54. We running up. The, we smashing the gas on their ass, bro. We finna match the gas on their ass. They out of here. They discombobulated. They equilibrium. Knock the fuck off. It's knock the fuck off. They don't know what to do. They don't know what to do. Look, look. You better dunk it. Jabari, don't you do that. Man, get the fuck. Man, I'm done. Jabari, boy. Mm. Mm. You said why I went quiet. The bar got me heated, bro. We was on a good rhythm. He went up too soft on that plate, man. I mean, he's still playing good, but like when we when we turned up like this, when we turned up like that, I'm gonna toss who six seven dunking on everybody that's in his face, and you six eleven and you come down to get your shit blocked and swatted. That's why I got quiet. I'm not mad. I got frustrated, though. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> Jabari Smith Jr. 5 for 9. Hey, let's get the lights up, too. Let's get the lights up, bro. Let's get over 100 people in the building. Halftime show going to be lit. You know what I'm saying? Hit the like button. Uh, But Jabari Smith Jr. 5 for 9 from the field. 2 for, two, two for 3 from 3. He a plus 19. Plus 19 for Jabari Smith Jr. 12 points. Uh, Armin Thompson. Seven for eight from the field. All of them twos, no threes. 14 points for Armin Thompson, four rebounds. Uh, Dylan Brooks, four for eight from the field with 10 points. Hey, my mic tripping, fam? What Miss Kiki at? Hey, hey, my mic. Hey, press one if my mic is right, y'all. Press one if my mic is right. Hey, Fred Van Vliet, one for four shooting. Fred ain't even trying to shoot. Fred ain't even trying to do nothing like that. Two points for Fred Van Vliet, but he has 12 assists. That shows you his impact. 
My mic good? Bet, bet that, bet that. Appreciate that. Bet that. So, 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 yeah. Uh, two points for Fred. Uh, 12 assists, fam. 12 assists. Jaden Green, 4 for 8 from the field, 14 points. There she go. I, I know she was there listening. Uh, 14 points, 4 for 8 from the field for uh, Jaden Green. Uh, off the bench, 5 points for Jeff Green. 3 points for Reggie Bullock. 8 points for Jason Tate. And uh, Jock Landale, two points in his ball game. Five for six shooting from the field for the Rockets. Four for 47% from the three. 20, 20, what, 20 assists for the Rockets, bro. 20 assists. That's, that's cool. That's some cool speed. 25%, 25 rebounds and four turnovers for the Rockets. 47% from the field for the uh, Cavs. 33% from the three. They can't make a goddamn thing from the three, bro. Our perimeter defense is like that. The switch, The switches. You know, the guard play, you know, uh, other than Fred Van Vliet, man, uh, being 5'10", 5 5'11", 5 uh, uh, being uh, six foot, if you want to call it, he's the smallest player, but he still can play defense. You know what I'm saying, Ms. V? Fred Van Vliet, small enough to play defense, impactful defense as far as a team. Uh, the Cleveland Cavaliers, they have eight turnovers, and we're still in the first half. The Rockets are playing some 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 crazy basketball, and Jada all said this, bro. When the LP went down, I got real nervous and shook because I know LP presence is a big presence. And he told me on it, he was saying on the stream, like, hey man, it, it could be a blessing in the skies, you know, for the for everybody else to really play as a team. You know, uh matchups matter when it comes to like playing against Denver in the playoffs, Sacramento Kings and guys with bigs. But this is the game that shows us like our level of play and like what can we do without LP. And it's the defense, it's, 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 it's everything after that, you know. So, man, let's just hope they can keep the pace going into the first half. I mean, going into the second half, I'm going to drop the link for the halftime show. Y'all come in and rip, you know what I'm saying, if you have time to say something. If not, man, we're going we gonna to rock out regardless, bro. But at the same time, bro, it's a good game. 70 to 54, 16-point game. The Cleveland Cavaliers, 10 points for Niang or Coral with five points. Jerry Allen with eight. Darius Garland with five. Donovan Mitchell with 11, right? Uh, Levert off the bench with eight points. Five points for Merrill. Merrill. Houston Rockets, man. Uh, Houston Rockets. Jabari Smith Jr. with 12 points. 14 points for Armin Thompson. Dylan Brooks with 10 points. Fred Van Vliet with two points, 12 assists. And Jabari, like I said, it looked like he's having a, uh, a mediocre game as far as the finishes and stuff like that when it comes down to punching the issue. But he has tw he, he's a plus 19 for the game. Jaden Green, 14 points. Eight points for Jason Tate. Jock Landell gave you some good production off, uh, off the bench as a big. 56% shooting for the Rockets, 47% from the three. Hey, Laro, what's good, Laro? What you got on the first half, bro? Hey, man, look, I like everything I'm seeing, bro. I can't complain about anything other than Jabari's weakness, dog. I get it. He plus 17 or whatever he is, man. But, I mean, we all winning by what? Uh, uh, 16. 16 points. <laughs> we all winning by 16 points. So I can't really just give him a pass for that. But, I mean, somebody got to get to him, man. He may, he got to be email somebody. But it's not his effort. At times, even though I don't see him going at people's shots like he should at, at that height. But uh, pretty much, man, look, Jalen, if you keep this up, boy, if you show this consistency, man, I'm a big fan, homie. And uh, <laughs> one other thing I did notice, bro, I know those uh, preseason and, and early, uh, like, measurements or whatnot. Hey, bro, uh, twin don't look like he's 6'7 no more, bro. That dude's a gay. Yeah, he, he play like he's 16, man. <laughs> Bro, real talk, man. So uh, I let man, bro. I, I like what I see. I mean, yeah, I know Steph coming back uh, tonight or tomorrow. So I mean, it, it might no, be yeah, tough. Yeah, but. yeah. It, it, you know what I'm saying? That that gang on it, it, it's between them two Lakers and the Golden State Warriors. So they play each other tonight. But yeah, he played. He played. He come back tonight against the Lakers. Yeah. Oh, okay. That's so on. so so we really gonna be locked in on how how both of those teams really produce going forward because. You know, I know we we looking at it on our end, but they have to lose and and they have they record have to, you know what I'm saying, drop as far as the loss column for us to gain, you know what I'm saying, motion and traction to get that play in. So yeah, like, right, I get it. I get it. 
Yeah, 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 yeah. That's all I had, though. That's all I had. Genius. Blessings. Blessings. Bless up. Bless up. Bless up. <laughs> I like what I'm seeing, man. If Jalen continues this, I gotta take my my uh, my contract up, Batman. But I, that would be a, that would be good. I mean, it's all about the team, like I said. You know, I'm a Rockets fan, so if I gotta eat my words on the contract, then I, that would be great for the team. That means he's playing damn good. But I mean, I've been I've been saying this like you know, a couple of times. The difference b- between Jalen's um, top end potential and him just being a role player is gonna come down to the sh- his shot, bro. If Jalen can find the consistency outside, it's, it, his his entire game is gonna be different, bro. And it's obvious, bro. When it when his shot is falling, mm-hmm. he's a different player. He's just a different player. So that's why I said his number one goal in the off season is to stay in the lab and work on that shot. Because if that shot consistently could be 35, 36% from three, he's a totally different player, bro. Because he has the quickness. So you gotta you gotta pick your poison. You're gonna tr- try and stop him. Outside, you're gonna give him the lane. So, I'm not, I'm not out on him. I think that the shot is just, it's just that. And if he continues this, this um, this stretch, bro, um, the contract, I'll revisit that. I'm not gonna overreact to to the two or three games, but um, yeah. I'm liking what I'm seeing. Um, Jabari, though, bro, he he. Yeah, I was I'm gonna like, ask you, uh, what you got on Jabari, man. Yeah, he, he every game um, he's like he gets a shot blocked, bro, too often from smaller dudes as well, bro. But I think the thing is that he came into the league as a small forward, to be honest. When 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 I looked at his um his draft um profile, he, he he's really a small forward in a in a in a six eleven body. So I don't think he really he has he, he's not naturally that aggressive uh, like a big should be. But I'm hoping that um he may can can work with him. He needs to get, you know, 15 pounds stronger. Um, and just his mentality, bro, has to change that. When he's going up, bro, he can't just be half ass going up, getting his shot blocked by Karis LeVert, bro, who is like 6'5". That, that, that can't work, man. So he needs to play up to his size, bro. Uh, but all in all, bro, I, I li- I'm liking what I'm seeing. I'm liking the free floor, the offense, Jalen getting to the rim. And that's... A, that, that, that's um, Due to Shengu not really clogging the lane either, bro. You gotta look at that. Because most of the time he's coming down, Shengu is already in the paint calling for the ball. So with him out, then you know, he has more space to work. Right. So that that's a topic for the for the post game, you know. Gotcha. But I'll let you go on to the next um panelist, man. Oh yeah. Oh yeah, I'm gonna go to Miss V real quick. But real quick, Miss V, shout out to my boy uh 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 my dog Vic. With the cash out, with the 50 bomb in the cash out, man. Appreciate the love and support, Vic. General salute to the homie Vic in the cash out with the bomb. Appreciate it, Vic. General salute, homie. Uh, Miss V, what you got, Miss V? Salute to you, mama. Hold on. I can't, I, I can't hear you, Miss V. Hold on, son. Can y'all hear her? Hold on. It sound like you're far away from the mic. Let me Right. Yeah. Just they say they can't hear in the chat. Go out and come right back in, Miss V. Cause I know she gonna cook on the. Uh, I know she gonna. I know she got something to say. Uh. So yeah, man. Hey, Laro, man. Uh. And genius to Miss V get back. How um how y'all think we what, what, what's the main focal point next in the, in the next half though? You uh, know, as far as like you know, what I'm saying I know what we're doing right now, man. And, and, and how y'all feel about Armin Thompson as well? Hey man, yeah, that boy playing. Go ahead, go ahead, Larry. No, I'm just saying, man. He he playing strong, bro. I mean. Man, he finishes around the rim better than anybody on this team, bro. He goes up strong, and he just he just has it, bro. I mean, his bounces is it's on par, if not even better than Jalen's, bro. Like that boy got that bounce, man. I'm not sure about his pure uh, point guard abilities yet, but I mean, maybe he might not be a point guard, but he he, he good with something that we gonna need, bro. I, 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 he he a wing, bro. Just call him a wing, dog. So yeah, he a wing. But, 
He'll win. He'll win. So, yeah, yeah. I, I feel good about him, dog. He finished around the rim like anybody I've ever seen, dog. Real talk. I like him like, man, player His comp. defense, Laro, that play, boy defense, for real. Play, play, player comp right now, Scotty Pippen, dog. <laughs> that, that's my hey. player comp for him right now, bro. Yeah. It ain't too far fetched. It ain't too far fetched. It ain't too far fetched. Miss V, you there? Hey, I hit you up too, dog. Hold on. Hold on. Let me check that. Hey, Miss V, you there? She got some mic issues going on. Man, shout out to the big dog, the big homie, man, Laro, man, showing love today. Dropping some bombs in the cash up, you dig? You know what I'm saying, man? Appreciate that, Laro. Real talk, homie. But yeah, bro, Laro, that, 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 uh, that, that Scotty Perry, Scotty Pippa comparison, bro, like, a lot of people say, oh, he's a, He's a, he's a Magic Johnson type of player coming in, you know what I'm saying? Because he's a he's a point drafted as a point guard. But I'm like, I don't know, man. J Dog might have been right about him being a wing, bro. Because I'm looking like they drafted him as a point guard. I'm looking at the assists, but it's a 20 and 10, and that's the that's the points and rebounds. And he ain't even shooting no threes, that road. Yeah, I, I think I think he, he can be a secondary ball handler, bro. I, I see the, the Scotty Pippen comes. I, I also see some Dennis Rodman as well, bro. Um, Scotty Pippen slash Dennis Rodman, the, the younger version of Dennis Rodman before he started doing all that crazy shit. But, um, yeah, I think he could be a second uh, secondary ball handler as well, bro, for his size, you know. But I don't think he's, he's going to be the guy that you want to have handling the ball 30 minutes for the game, you know. Oh, yeah. And by the way, Dylan, bro, you're not Kyrie Irving, dog. Get a ball up to who it belongs to, bro. Stop all the stop all the foolishness, man, and, and know your role. I see now what they was talking about in, in Memphis, bro. Come on, dog. You got to stop it, man. You got to stop it, bro. So, I mean, that's what I have on the first half, man. I think Miss V is back. Miss V, you there? Miss V, you on mute, mama. She keeps yeah. I think she's trying to get her mic right. Yeah. But yeah, for the second half, though, Green, I think that um just keep the defensive intensity. Um Armin, when you have Armin and, and um Dylan in the game at the same time, that's gonna be a good defensive lineup. So just 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 um continue the defensive intensity. That that's my second half. Um the oh, defense, yeah. Yeah, stay with the defense uh, scheme of things because I think, like, we really making it tough for Darius Garland and, you know, Donovan Mitchell as well. We're making them shoot, like, very deep contested threes. And I think that's because our perimeter play, they're going to have to see Jalen to a certain degree. Not saying he's the best defender, but he's going to give some uh, uh, some effort. You got Armand Thompson, who's a go-to perimeter defender. You got Dylan Brooks. You got Jabari Smith, who's not a slouch on perimeter defense. Uh, so like I, 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 we need to get that going. And, and as far as like points in the paint, I think we can let some shit slide. Don't give them everything in the paint, but I think threes are more worthy than twos, right? So don't let these threes just, just, just have them have wide open threes and stuff like that. So I think we we good on hey, switches and stuff. Hey, yo, agree. I gotta say it again, man. One more time. I looked at, I just looked at Jalen stat line, bro. He's yeah. actually affecting the game by not shooting, bro. He rebounded and do it every day. I right. gotta give it up to him. I, I can't hey, deny it. But 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 still, <laughs> that that makes you efficient though. You ain't gotta be shot jacking like like bro. Them one for tens, the one for eight games. You don't need I, to I, this I, shit. I've been doing the thing, man. I'm gonna let you rock out in this second half talk already. He under the basket doing the thing. Oh, I'm, okay, I'm okay, gonna, the game to start. All, all right, right Larry, I got you. Bet, all bet, right, bro. Bet. <laughs> we finna get back to it. Shout out to the cast. Shout out to the panel. Uh, they hit the hit the link, man, at the halftime. So we're gonna get back to the game, play by play. Miss V, I got you. I got you. Pull up for the post game, Miss V. What's up, baby girl? Yeah. 
We finna go with auntie. Auntie. Salute to everybody. Salute to everybody. They said trying to get it. Darius Gordon with the step back in and out. He goes up. Hey, can y'all hear me check? Can y'all hear me, people? You can hear me, V? All right, I lost connection on the... Lost connection on the game on my end. Hold on. Hold on, man. Who cooking? Okay, okay. We in timeout. I see we in timeout on my end. So, yeah, man, we have a 79 56 game. Let me read the stats for me to catch up. For me to catch up real quick. So you got uh, Jabari with 15 points, 6 for 10 shooting, 3 for 4 from the 3. Uh, Armand Thompson, God. Armand Thompson killed it, huh? 18 points leading the way. No threes, 8 for 10 from the field, 2 for 3 from the three. Uh, free throw line, 5 rebounds for Armand Thompson. Twin doing his thing. 10 points for Dylan Brooks, 4 for 8 from the field. Uh, Fred Van Vliet, 13 points, 1 for 6 from the field. Not the best shooting night for Fred tonight, only 2 points, but he's still a plus 16 uh, from the game. You have Jalen Green, 5 for 10, shooting from the field, 16 points. <clears throat> three for, 5 for 10, 3 for 6 from the 3, and 9 rebounds. So he's affecting the game in different ways, like Laro just alluding to at the halftime. Uh, so 16 points, 9 rebounds for Jalen. Man, I like to see it, man. I like to see the effort. I like to see it, bro. Uh, Je Jeff Green, 5 points. Reggie Bullock, 3 points. 8 points for Jason Tate. And Jot Land there only two points in his game in nine minutes. The Rockets shooting 55% from the field, 45% from the three, four turnovers, 30 rebounds, 22 assists. Uh hey, Miss V, if you're still in chat, you can pull up to see uh, you know, so I get you right on your mic. You know what I'm saying? I don't mind trying to get you right because I know you I know you got something to say, Miss V. I know Miss V got something to say. For the Cleveland Cavaliers, 10 points. 10 points for uh, Niang, Okoro with five points. Uh, Jared Allen with eight points. Only four rebounds for Jared Allen. Garland with seven points and Mitchell with 11 points. And we're going to the second half and we lead by 23. It's a 23 point game, bro. Uh oh, there you go. Hold up. I knew, yeah, I knew you gonna pull up. What up, Jada? Jada, pull up. Jada, pull up. Jada, where you at, dog? Jada, pull up, nigga. They thought the Rockets was going to fold against a, a big team. Nah, nigga. We here. 79-56. 79-56. Here we go. We back at it. 
We back at it. As the Cleveland Cavaliers, they give it up to Jared Allen. Jared Allen one-on-one. Swinging it. Levert with the spin move. Goes up back to Garland. Pump fake. Step back. Gives up to Levert again. Swinging it to Niang. He drives. Niang with a floater. And he get that to go. He gets it to go. 79 to 58. 79-58. Cleveland. Catch a slip in one time. 21-point game. Jalen Green driving on the Yang. Nowhere to go. Turn around. Fatal. He missed it. Um, Thompson trying to crash the glass. And it's out of bounds. Knocked out of bounds. And the Steel Rockets ball. Let's go. Let's go. Almond Thompson. The Rockets turned it over. Left. Oh, oh, and they get the layup to go. A coral with the layup. A coral with the layup. Jalen Green with it on the perimeter to get up to Fred Van Vliet. Fred off the screen. Fred with the jab step. No, that's Jalen with the jab step. Oh, <laughs> Jalen got money. Jalen got bread, man. Jalen got bread with the step back there yeah, still. Pull up 19 and 9 for Jalen. Mm hmm. This that 25 and 5, Jalen, that I've been wanting to see all year long, man. That's Armin Thompson, bro. Armin Thompson. Armin Thompson, like a little grasshopper. He's a little grasshopper, bro. Stay on the court, stay on the floor real quick. I like the intensity, though. I like the intensity for Armin. You feel me? You feel me? 82 to 60. Niang gets the first free throw. There you go, Jabbar. Jabbar pushing it. Jalen Green to the rack. Goes up. And it's knocked out of bounds by the Rockets. What up, Big Steve? What it do, brother? What it do, what it do? We're loving this game. Good Already, day. man. Listening to you. The boys out there hooping. But Cas Avert just cashed in for a three. He just cashed in for a three, Big Steve, man. The boys running the guns, Big Steve, man. I like, I like the, I like, I like they still playing hard. You feel me? It's Fred Van Vliet just cashed in for nineteen. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. A seven sixty five. Levert lost the rock, almost loses it, gets it back. It's Fred Van Vliet got hit in the face. Turnover, offensive foul by the Cavs. What you saying, Big Steve? Yes, I'm loving this. I mean, we got to keep this going. I mean, we keep this going, bro. Uh, some great things can happen at the end of the season. That's 
Most definitely. Most definitely. And that's all I've been wishing for. My 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 highest hopes was playing. Just so these young dudes can get can 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 sniff some blood, taste a little blood. See how that real, real deal basketball is really made of when lights is really bright, bright, you know. Jaden with the pull up, he missed. Okoro, nowhere to go. He gives it up. Give it up to Donovan Mitchell. Donovan Mitchell with the drive to Allen. Allen goes up. He missed a point blank layup. P missed a point blank layup. Here come the Rockets. Ray Van Vliet with the slow motion. 87 65. Off the screen by Jock Landale. Fred pulls the trigger from three. Fred, bangers. Fred starting to step it up, dope. Fred stepping it up, nigga. Dylan Brooks, you've been sitting on 10 points since the first quarter. Fred and Kyle caught you in, in two minutes. I mean, uh, uh, in a quarter. In a quarter. Here come Armin Thompson. Give it up to Dylan Brooks. He want to shoot the three. He bricked it. Rebounded by the uh, Cavs. Garland with the hezzy. Going to the rack. He goes up. Missed the layup. He blew it. Levert with the rebound. Gets fouled by Dylan Brooks. Come on, man. Now, Fred a killer, bro. Fred get in the right situation. Like, see, him and Dylan Brooks was made to be in the playoffs. They been just trying to let these young dudes really breathe and grow. I've been trying, I've been preaching this all season, bro. Just really breathing. All season long. Cash the very 11 points tonight, ladies and gentlemen. We have a 90-65 game, man. The Rockets came out and really put some Timberland boots on their faces, bro. Stomping them out. Stomping them out. Bucket is good for Karis LeVert. Bucket is good for Karis LeVert. 90-67. 450 to go in the third. Fred Van Vliet off the screen by. Oh, they give up Jalen Green. Jalen Green with the catch and shoot three. He missed it. Rebound by Donovan Mitchell. Donovan Mitchell kicked it ahead. Levert stepped back for a three. He missed it. Rebound by Armand Thompson. He gives it up. Oh, Fred Van Vliet for three. He missed it. Jalen Green with the rebound. Jalen Green goes up against the bucket. Jalen Green said, I want the alley, but I recovered. I recover it. Keep playing your position, Jalen. 21 10 for Jalen, nigga. They feed off each other, bro. They feed off each other, nigga. Look at this dumbass shit, Levert, giving up to Tristan Thompson. I told you he better. Jock Landell better than you, ho. Jock Landell better than you, Tristan. You PED eating ass nigga. Man, stop playing, bro. Yo, get big on him, Jalen. Talk your shit, my nigga. Talk your shit, young G. Talk your shit, young G. Yo. Yo. 92 to 67, bro. Jock Landell. Ain't no LP out there. No LP. Fred, trying to get busy with Tristan Thompson. Tristan, you got a kickball on the plate. <laughs> Jalen with 21 to 10, fam. Uh, 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 Jabari Smith with 15 points, six rebounds. Armin Thompson, their boy Armin, 18 points. You did? You did? Jabari, boy, stop fumbling. Man, this nigga here. Jabari with the turnover. Here come Donovan Mitchell. They in the bonus. 320 left to go in the third quarter. 92-67. Donovan Mitchell goes up. Mike misses the layup. Here come Jalen Green. The Rockets in the fast break. Jalen getting busy. Euro, left hand scoop. Buckets, nigga. Get out of my face, ho. Yeah, Donovan Mitchell, get your bitch ass up, boy. Get up. Get up. 
Get up. Get up. Niggas want to come up. Oh, I want this. I want this two go. We need to trade Jalen Green. Now all of a sudden in the month of March, Jalen Green beasting all these niggas. Y'all want to play with me. Don't want to show y'all face. Don't want to do none of that. Nigga, I, I, I hold my nerves on everything. Nigga, we ain't lose a draw. Big dogs don't want to come up here and show their face over here, nigga, because I know what it is when they when they when they when they snip this green leaf exclusive smoke. You feel me? You feel me? The fuck is we talking about? Fuck we talking about, man. If y'all want to donate to the channel, cash up dollar sign X Green Leaf in the PayPal, the link is in the post in the comment section, nigga. Niggas getting their bread off of Jalen. Yeah, get these boys paid, Jalen. Get these boys paid, man. Get them paid, man. Get them up out of here. We have a 94-67 game, man. We talking about a, uh, a third seed in the East. I mean, a third seed in the East. Stop playing with you, man. You're doking the schemes. Nigga, we got the best coach. We have the best young core. You know what I'm saying? It just takes time. Do, do y'all not remember last year? OKC was in the same position. We had the same record as OKC Thunder last year, 31-35. Last year. Check the facts. So, bro, at the end of the day, we on the right path. We on the right path. Y'all niggas on some popcorn shit. Y'all on some microwave air fry shit. And want to get some, want some Jalen Browns of the world, and and he he ain't show shit how how, how he can produce on his own merit. No, I know, I understand that, Miss V. I understand. Only guards understand. Only guards understand. You know uh, what Jalen going through, and that's a fact. Only guards know. Only guards know it's easy. It's easy to get your points back to the basket if you like that. But all these guards ain't really like that either. Look at look at Tristan Thompson injuring his own players, being wild and shit. Get your old get your ass up out of here. You done injured your own player. <laughs> you feel me? Get up out of here, Tristan. Levert missed the jump shot. He gets the rebound. We're still in the third quarter. As Levert goes to the rack, nowhere to go, gives up to Tristan Thompson. He goes up to whoop to do floater, and that's good. And that's good. Fred Van Vliet to Jot Landell. Jot Landell swinging it to Reggie Bullet. Reggie Bullet pulls up. Nope. Hey, Reggie Bullet. Man, just shoot the goddamn ball, bro. You ain't no playmaker like that. You, you you only got one job, and that's shoot. So if you put the ball down and pick that bitch up, either you shoot it. Don't try to make a decision, bro. Don't think for yourself. Don't do that. We got people to handle that business for you. Yeah, get that bitch up to Fred. Here comes Fred Van Vliet. Fred Van Vliet gets it up half court. Fred one-on-one. -on -one. Off the screen, crossover. Fred going up, got bumped. Shoots the mid-range shot, missed it. Rebound by the Cavs. Garland, he bringing it up. Gives it up to Levert. Levert goes up. They all call that for Levert, but it's not call that for Fred Van Vliet, man. That's the same goddamn Bob Carl, bro. That's the same Carl, man. What are we doing? The hell? Anyway, man, get the likes up. 94 to 70. As the Rockets lead by 24 on the Cavaliers. 
Then a bonus two minutes left to go in the third quarter. 94 to 70. Jabari Smith with the rebound. Giving up the Fred Van Vliet. Fred. Being patient. They give up to Jock Landale. Jock Landale moving it. They give it up to Jabari. Jabari got the mismatch and he gets fouled. There you go, real. There you go, real. Call the play how it's supposed to go. <laughs> nah, it just be them outsiders thinking they know Rockets basketball. Ain't never been right about a goddamn thing. Just running they running they dick suckers and not being real or, or, or being real about it, bro. They get caught up in this YouTube shit and just say any goddamn thing, man. You know, that's what it is. They should say any goddamn thing. Jai Landell, Jai Landell with the bucket. 96 to 70. 96 70. Carries the vert. Back to careless. Careless. Lavert. <laughs> Tristan. PED. PED Tristan. Nowhere to go. Jai Landell with the good defense. Hey, hey, John Landell don't need no goddamn PEDs to look good in this league. He don't need to do all that. Look at the ball movement for the Rockets, bro. That's team basketball. That's this been, that's been. If you know basketball, you know what the Rockets is doing, bro. It's like hot potato. It's not no one-man show right now. Look at Tristan Tom. Get your bum ass up out of here. Are you right-handed or left-handed, bro? Make a decision. Make a decision. Jaden Green got 23. What Donovan Mitchell got since everybody want to get, since niggas want to trade? Man, Donovan Mitchell got 11 points, bro. This nigga, and y'all want to trade Jaden Green for Donovan Mitchell? Hold up, bro. Let me take a shot real quick. Let me say something. This nigga shot the ball 12 goddamn times. Him and Garland. Garland got nine points. Donovan Mitchell got 11. Right? Jaden Green, 17 shot attempts, 23 points. Man, get up out of here, bro. Y'all want to argue with me. Y'all want to argue with me. Jot Landale with another bucket. Jot Landale with, with six points now. H Town. I'm the only H Town nigga to stand on H Town business in this basketball community. And believe that. Believe that. Believe that. Believe that. Only H Town nigga stand on business. And the only nigga in this, in this community to stand on a team. Believe that shit too. We have a 98 to 73 game. Ain't no rentals. <laughs> ain't, ain't ain't nobody renting me. Jalen Green ain't renting me because I'm a fan. Oh, hey, oh, you, you, Greeny for uh Jalen Green fan. Wrong nigga. I've been a Rockets fan since 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 since, since 90 since 94. When I was a pup. I could cook everybody team. I could cook everybody favorite player. But, but get, get, get ready for it, too. Get ready for it, nigga. Since 94, Rockets fans, nigga. Ain't no switch up shit since Steve Francis. Since, since, since T-Mac. I know everybody love T-Mac. T-Mac ain't got us out the first round. Y'all mean ain't got us out the first round. James Harden, and that's the thing about Jalen Green, bro. We in, we in a fan base where everybody still attests to James Harden, right? Everybody still attests to James Harden, going wherever he go. And not really just, you know what I'm saying, it, putting their putting putting love and support for the Rockets community like that, bro. 
I'm just saying, man, and the hit dog gonna holler. I'm not taking shots at no individual person. I'm just being real about what I see as far as this rockers community. So if you feel some type of way, nigga, stay away from me and or pull up if you got nuts to say something. You know what I'm saying? Don't hide. Don't do none of that. Ain't nobody fucking with me with this rocket shit, bro. At all. So, hey, man, say, man. It is what it is, bro. Like I said, the play in, I've been saying standing on play in business, and I'm going to keep standing on it. I don't know how everybody else feel about it, but that's, how, that's what I'm going to do. We here, man. Get the likes, subscribe to the channel, man. Yeah, I seen Drake in the building, man. He's he's Steven ass too. Where you think that standing on business come from, bro? Do people really think I just be talking, bro? I, I created this standing on business. I created that, bro. Everybody who know, know. Yeah, big time YouTuber stealing my lingo, still doing it. That standing on business, that's what that was my shit. That was my shit. Shout out to Drake. I see he in the building. He on the sideline. I don't talk to just be talking, bro. What I say, I mean that shit, bro. I created that stand on business. One hundred to seventy nine. Jabari got hurt. Jabari got hurt. Mash the gas. Pay attention to who you listen to, bro, and see, see, see. Oh, Greeley been saying that, and I don't listen to none of these niggas. Boys want to steal a sauce from certain niggas, bro. And it, and this game right here, we have a one hundred to ninety seven was one hundred to seventy nine game. This game is damn near. We in the fourth quarter. I don't see nothing that the Cavs can do. Y'all saying Jabari hurt? Man, come on, man. Oh, no, nah, no, nah, Jabari should be good. He should be good. That's that P.E.D. Tristan Thompson punk ass, bro. Man, man settle down somewhere. Now, nah, he, tweak, he tweaked his shit. That's just bar just being flimsy and fragile. At the same time, Chris, Tristan Thompson, get your old ass up out of here, bro. You ain't got the same speed, same NBA game speed like you used to. So these, these dudes moving a lot quicker, a lot more modal than you. So hopefully, hopeful that Jabari is still good to finish this game. We have a 179 game, man. This game is a wraps, bro. It's a wraps. <laughs> Daryl say, walk that shit off. <laughs> yeah, fair. Like, walk that shit off, dog. 
I did that by two, three times in one game, and still, still was up there just doing it for the love of the game. You know what I'm saying? Boys get paid to play the game and not play just for the love of the game. Walk this shit off. He good. Look at the movie. You shoot, all you do is shoot anyway. Reggie Bullet. Back to Jabari Smith. Jabari on knee yang. Turn around jump shot. Walk that shit off, nigga. Walk that shit off, Jabari. Jog it off. 20 points with Jabari. Yeah. 20 and 7. Partner. 103 to 79. Man, this shit is over with, bro. So all you Rockets channels with the stat shits. Oh, I want to see what the Rockets do without Alpern Chin Goon. I want to see what these guys do without the Alper Shingoon. Yeah, bitch. You got all the analytics now, nah, nigga. Now go, run and tell that. Run and tell that, nigga. All on Twitter saying all kind of dumb shit. Man, shut up, nigga. You know, I, I niggas just be talking. Want to shit on Jalen Green, but, but guess what? LP ain't out there, so I'll, guess what you all you got to talk about? Jalen Green, motherfucker. Talk about Jalen Green now, motherfucker. You shot jock ass niggas. Talk about Jalen Green now, nigga. Yeah, expose Jalen Green now on your DMs now, nigga. Yeah, you want to talk about him? Talk about him then, nigga. You bitch ass niggas that's walking around here like that. I'm the only real nigga on this Rockets real shit. You other niggas is clowns, bro. Clowns, look at them running. Look at look at they supporters running. Yeah, get your bitch asses up out of here too, because I know y'all niggas ain't subscribed like that. That's why I ain't showing y'all face in the chat, bitch. But guess what? I'm him, nigga. I've been on that shit, bitch. Now niggas want to do streams every four days and some shit. Don't move how I move, ho. <laughs> I ain't giving you nigga shit. Niggas running now. Niggas running. You see Miss Kiki? They run. They want to run now. Just had eighty people in the building. Nine seventy. Niggas running like some little girls, like some little pussies. Nigga, pull your pants up. Nigga, pull your skirt up, ho. Pull your skirt up, ho. Punk ass niggas. And you got some weirdo ass niggas ready to ready to go in there and talk talk to them. Nah, nigga, I'm grinding with it, nigga. I'm standing on business. Nigga, I stand on principle. Not all that real, not that weird old nurse talk shit from a grown ass man talking some nurse talk, nigga. We ain't talking no nurse talk, nigga. We we here with the we, we here for for that real shit. We here with it. Much of nurses, much of grown grown men, man, get your money. The money gonna talk, but at the same time, nigga, don't when it comes to the basketball, bro. This, basketball and sports is real grimy. We don't need none of that elevated music talk. Yeah. Get up on my face, man, with y'all agendas and propaganda, bro. Y'all niggas one face to with it. Y'all ready for the Rockets to lose? Oh. This the biggest game. This the biggest game for the Rockets. No Alper Shingoon. I want to see. Oh, oh, the defense is good. Shout out to you, Major Doka. Nigga, get shout out to the players. You did when Alp was out there. Y'all was giving praise to Alp when the defense was legit. Not to my niggas. I'm talking about them other niggas that don't want to stand on business. I'm going to call all you suckers out. And, yeah, and some of y'all know who I'm talking about in this Rockets community. Yeah, talk about that, bro. Talk about that. Been telling y'all, y'all boys, fraudulent. Been telling y'all niggas, bro. I'm on their ass, man. I'm matching the gas on their ass real quick. I'm talking my shit. And guess what, nigga? When we, we, when we more relevant and we really running games like this, nigga, we just in the play-in hopes. Wait till we get back to championship uh, talk. Y'all really going to hate Greenleaf. And I want the day ones to stay A1 when they around me. None of that weirdo shit. Look at Reggie Bullet just jacking up shit. Get your, get your ass. I know the game over with Reggie Bullet. Shoot all you want. This shit is over with, bro. This shit is over with. Look at Donovan Mitchell. Trying to, trying to, he, he desperate. Man, this shit is a wrap, man. This shit is a wrap, dog. It's a 23 point lead on the Keevan 
Cleveland Cavaliers, who got the same records as, as the goddamn uh, uh, Hall of Fame of Spurs. I mean, not Spurs, Clippers. The Hall of Fame of Clippers team right now. That's why we tell the NBA, man, stop playing the games with the Hall of Famers, bro. They, they, they tricking y'all, man. Hey, Adam Silver, don't let these, don't let these dudes, uh, 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 uh play you, bro. Move these young dudes. Move them. Move the Paulo Pancaros. That's a fifth seed, in, in his second year. You know what I'm saying? Rip all these young dudes, dog. These old players ain't bringing you money like that. They want to see these young dudes shine, bro. Fuck these old ass niggas, bro. It's a young niggas world. It's a young. It's a young. It's a. It's a young human being world, bro. It's been like that, man. That's the circle of life. But real OGs, real people gonna understand. We are gonna break down, bro. If the young niggas acting up, we know we see the play, and that's how you got guys like Jada Al, Arrow, Mike Williams, King. You know what I'm saying? The OGs. They, they and you know what I'm saying. The print. They gonna come around and speak that real shit. About these young niggas, bro. They see what they see. They seen them before. We just trying to say don't do the same shit, bro. Be something better. Be something different. I know what the young rockers got. I know what they have. It's unfortunate that LP didn't got injured. Right? It's unfortunate that LP got injured. But now we playing a different way. Get the opportunity for a guy like Armand Thompson, Jalen Green, and Jabari Smith to really show up and really spread their wings. So we have a 108, well, we're 103 to 181 game. I'm a Thompson. He gives up to Jabari Smith Jr. Jabari for three. He missed it. Rebound by the Cavs. They give up the knee aim. Knee aim back up top with it. I don't even know who the homie and name is. Garland goes up to Alley Oop. Jared Allen with the finish from the uh, Alley Oop. Buckets. Buckets. I'm a Thompson. On the left wing, gives it up. Uncle Jeff to Jabari Smith Jr. Off the screen, Jabari driving. Back to Uncle Jeff. He goes up with the layup. Bucket is good. 105 to 83. Man, hold up, man. I need to, man, fuck it. Hey, uh, press one if you think the gap, if the if you if you think the Cavs gonna uh make a 20 point run. Press two if you don't. If I see more twos than ones, I'm about to drop the link right now so I can open up the panel real quick. It's a 105 to 83 game. Somebody say zero. <laughs> Laro say two. 105 to 83. Vic say two. Miss Kiki say two. One hundred five to eighty three, and Jaden Green got ripped. Levert going to the rack, and he gets the bucket in one twenty point game. Twenty point game. Yo. What's up, Lero? Man, I will say this, man. Look. Uh, 
my young dog i can't I, 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 can i call him a young dog my young dog why he got everybody why everybody his name and everybody mouth right now man this your time to shine because the world looking at you right now bro so if you buy a lot even though you did some sucker some sucker shit bro i mean your to name and everybody mouth. So if you balling out right now, everybody gonna see you balling out. So you might be worth that two twenty. I mean, he, <laughs> he balling like it now, bro. I will say that and I can't hate on him. But man, yeah. twin doing this thing, bro. <laughs> nah, <laughs> nah, nah, nah. Hey, nah, twin hooping, twin hooping, bro. And he ain't got to shoot no threes. He got eighteen points. Like, like, and he played defense. Do you agree Jaylen with, with another rebound? <laughs> okay. Nah, nah, Jalen, Jalen got he, he in the double figures, twenty four and eleven. So, but uh, who's it? Okay, okay. So, Laro, you think Jalen Green? Uh, you, you think you think he'll get two hundred? <sighs> Man, you know what? If it take doing the two hundred and 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 keeping him versus losing him and whatnot, bro, I, I wouldn't even disrespect him right now by giving him less than like one ninety, right? I ain't gonna disrespect him the way he's playing right now. I would not disrespect him by giving him less than one ninety. But yeah, so it ain't my it ain't my extra ten million or whatever, man. I pay him, bro, bro. I'll but play, I will I, say I'll this: just play the politics I, games, man. Hey, you know what? I will say this. Dog. I will say this. They playing a better band of basketball that I like to see. With Al, man, I don't want. I'm gonna nah, give you this too, nigga. Nah, I, man. I, I, like, I, I, nah, I, I'm, gonna it, it. I'm gonna say it. I'm gonna say it. I'm gonna say it. They playing a better brand of basketball without LP right now than with LP. And now I kind of see what you've been saying all season, and I gotta kind of give it to you a little bit. But I ain't just sure to say that we better with our, I'm not gonna say we better with our, with our, with our, with our, with our, no, with our I, I, know, I, I ain't ready. I, know, I, 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 ain't ready. I ain't gonna say I know that. You don't I don't want to go ready. there. But what I want to say is like I, I always said too, Laro, that it's a uh, it's a matchup matter, right? So I want all of them the guys to figure it out too, because I think it was a boring night for me. But if Jaden want to step, and even Jabbar tonight, 20 and 20 and 20 and seven, eight for thirteen. I know uh, uh, and seven, it's 20 and 7 right now, bro. Like, like Jalen was only 24 points. I mean, you know, it, it's what we've been earning for and yearning for, but at the same time, it's like I always wanted them to uh, produce together. And I would say, like, with ILP, we're going to play different regardless. I ain't going to lie. I like that red bone right there, man. I mean, that, that's cool. Yeah, I, I got you. I got <laughs> <Yeah>. you. <laughs> <laughs> hey, Big Steve, what's up, Big Steve? What you got, bro? Time, bro. Yes, they do play a different brand of basketball without our feet. They also play a different brand of basketball with as well during our wins. You know what I'm saying? Because we have one our feet. And he's there for those wins. So hey, BSD, it sound like your about- mic low. It sound like your mic low, BSD. I don't know if you need to refresh the page and come, go out and come back in. It's like, it's like you away from the mic. My bad. No, 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 yeah, yeah, just, just, just uh, refresh it real quick. It's, it's like your volume is very Let me low. Fix my mic. I'm, I'm back in. All right, bet that, bet that. So I, I guess old Drake ain't left since the rodeo uh, Tuesday night, bro. Oh, he showed up. He showed up. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. He ain't left. He ain't went nowhere. He ain't went nowhere. Hey, bro, on the cool, man, it seems like the uh, Toyota Center kind of rocking right now. I don't think it's a full crowd right now, but, hey, they turning up tonight, bro. Hey, in that bitch. Hey, that, that play yeah. that, that playing shit is, is real, man. Ain't nobody doing shit right now anyway. <laughs> For them ticket holders, them season holders. Yeah, but it's a, it's a big thing right now that the fact they showing up right now against a number three team in the east because no, because laro i heard i've been saying shit be seeing a lot of shit bro you know what i'm saying I, I know a lot of people we want the rockets to look a certain type of way without lp but go ahead and, and you know what i'm saying make your little podcast and oh we're going live you know what i'm saying like go ahead and do that we had dudes over here t- uh harping on that 6c shit niggas want and then they ran they ran away from here going going over there 
to make a t-shirt for your ass on some CT hey, shit. Like, like, what the fuck are we doing, bro? I, I agree. I will say this because you know, I, I came through to the in the summertime, so I, I just really wasn't no authentic just day one. <laughs> I, I, I'm not. Man, but, no, we, man, ain't, but, we ain't on them but, day but, one. But, shit but no, no but more, what bro. I'm trying to say, is, but what, since what I've seen, bro. I mean, I don't really just deal with like other well, rockets. My day street. ones don't pull up like that no more like that. So I ain't talking about it. Go ahead. Now, nah, what I'm saying is I, I don't even just listen to other rocket streams. I'm not saying I haven't, but during the summertime, I have seen a, a couple of dudes kind of like flip ship, dog. And I'm like, for real, dog? You over here talking about <laughs> you over here talking about being family and doing this and two days later you talked about being family over there. I mean, I know it's a competition in YouTube game, but you know what? Hey, bro, I'm from the fucking hood, dog. I don't deal with all that uh, different, you know, you know how you say it, man. All that, those corporate politics right. uh, voices and all that, man. I don't need all that weak shit, dog. I'm cool over here, bro. <laughs> like, real talk. Nah, man. Like, you know real talk, man. Here, bro. Like, you got to be built different over here. Straight up. You know what I'm saying? Hey, like, because, you can, because you, you will can, be tested I can, I can over let here, you talk, you I can let you get your opinion off, but at the same time, like, if somebody disputes your opinion, you got to be built to get this shit back because you're not going to finish just say what you got to say about somebody else's opinion, not them how they uh, approach you about yours. You feel me, Laro? I hear you, man. We up 18 with 416 left right now, man. Your boy House just in, in, uh, bounded the ball, man. Uh, I think we finna get the... All the uh, <laughs> I caught that early, right? But nah, I mean, right now, I mean, shit. I don't think he may just feel real comfortable with pulling everybody out until two minutes left. <laughs> so, <laughs> we got to secure the win, bro. I mean, nah, he still I, got to start. He still got to start. I mean, so. you know, I fuck all that. He may gonna go seal the deal. He may. Still a deal. I mean, it's unfortunate that LP got hurt when it was like what forty seconds to go against Sacramento. He made you know it's like, hey, bro, I gotta leave my guys out there, so I need this dude. But uh, dealing with, with the lefty, dog. <laughs> dealing with the lefty. What happened? Dealing with the lefty. What happened? We said, oh no, I just said dealing with the lefty. He don't he don't do that when he playing against uh first string players, dog. But I'm just saying that's all I said. God damn, Jalen. <laughs> hey, 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 we got a steal on the inbound. Hey, bro, it's over. It's over with, dog. I mean, everything. everything hey, hey, Larry, you remember when I said I don't give a fuck if Jalen got – if he go for eight for 20. If he got – if he if he doing that shit and he and we winning and we and he got that dog in him, bro, that shit don't matter, bro. That but Green, he playing. Kawhi Leonard but is, Green. The most, is, is the most efficient player of, of, of all time. Right, so yeah, yeah, that shit don't mean shit if you ain't winning, nigga. McGree, I ain't gonna lie, man. Child support Jalen playing like a beast, dog. Oh, Uncle yeah, Jeff for yeah, the dunk, yeah. dog. <laughs> 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 Uncle <laughs> Jeff for the dunk, dog. Hey, man, I'm gonna still take shots, but man, he playing like a baller right now, bro. He doing his thing, man. That's like, because he, he is throwing up more than Donovan Mitchell. He always been a he been a, he been a baller, bro. Just uh, take some oh, things in the season, man, to pull it out of. Him. See, it took something. It takes something for everybody, damn near, man. But I mean, he balling, bro. I mean, I, I can't deny that. I sound like a straight hater if I would be talking about man get rid of him. No, I mean, even though everybody said I was sound like a hater earlier, but. I mean, I can't deny what he's doing right now, bro. I mean, the dude is playing. He pulling oh, up. Nigga, nah, that nigga hooping, bro. He hooping. And it's something about that Jaden Green in March. He just show up and show out for some reason. You talking about child support and shit. I mean, I know they give you a little boost. You got to make that bread. <laughs> but, like, nigga, you going to get that money regardless, Jaden. Well, that's for damn sure. Yeah, I can't deny him getting the bread now. I mean, it, it still depends on the last few games. Man, you know what? You see what he can do. All I want to see is just, man, you know how sometimes what we do, bro. 
I mean, he just might fall off the earth and just go two for 17. I mean, I know a lot of good players do that, but Jalen, we don't need that from you right now. We trying to make the play in. LP out. Hopefully we get Cam back. So, bro, I mean, we need you to step up every night. And luckily, I don't know where it came from. I mean, he was a number four overall pick in the, uh, in the draft. But, man, twin balling like a Oh, that's a motherfucking fact, dog. Twin, bro. 18 points on 11 shots and, and, and ain't took a three. All of them is for like a dunker spot or he's just in a fast break scenario. Like, he only made one turnover, but, but you know, this, that shit happens. But, dog, uh, twin, man. Like, like, like I was saying, like, nigga hooping, bro. He hooping. He hooping. And we talk about guys going, like, LP going down for the count. Unfortunately, and it's all about the next man up. And twin, I think he's the one that well, that was really you can point your finger and say it stepped up. Uh, when when they when they went down, you know what I'm saying? As far as LP. Hey Green, remember in early in the season, I said we got four future uh, all stars on this team, and I still stand by that. Mm -hmm. We got four future all stars on one team, bro. Jaylen, I ain't going. Hey, hey, Armin Thompson. That's right. Man, I don't, you know what? Hey, Big C, since this since this game over with, man, I would have saved this for the post game, but I ain't gonna even lie. Just thinking in my head, bro. If we if we could had a Stephen Adams about uh about uh, ten years ago or uh, seven eight years ago, bro, on the cool with the way these young young dudes running, bro. Just a just a, a Clint Capella type dude would be good at center, bro. You know, just a, a rim runner and a guy who can block shots and play defense, man. Don't, that's what these young dudes hey, need, hey, man. Don't don't, don't get Jed his credit then, dog. That's what he's been yearning for all season, right? A, a player type player like that, but Steven Allen's gonna pr present something different. That physicality, screen, roll. That's for Jalen. You know what I'm saying? And uh. Hopefully, LP plays. I, I ain't worried about LP like that, but you know, so I think he's gonna be better coming back. But we talking about like forming his team up going forward, and dudes running on here tomorrow, Trey Jalen Green type shit. Hey, you know what? Oh, hey, bro. Hey, hey, bro. I, I, I'm not afraid to admit when I was wrong. You know what? But the thing is, oh, house for a nice little shot right there. But you know what? I mean, bro. Al P can actually run, dog. It's just like when we get he he can run. So I mean he can actually run with the pace. But the thing is, it's like sometimes we get bogged down with feeding him in the post and he can actually play. I mean, you, we have to find a nice and it, it's a young team. So once they find a nice mixture of the two, I think we're ready. And you know what? Just like you say, they need to get a taste of that blood this year, bro. <laughs> like real talk. Yeah. And, and, yeah. and if we barely make that the play in, we that's a taste. Yeah. We got the same records OKC last year when they was in the play in. When they was 10 C, 31 and 36, 35, whatever. You know what I'm saying? So we in that same trajectory with the veterans that we have and the Western Conference that got tougher. Teams got better in the West. Trades didn't happen. You got KD with the big three. You got the uh uh Clippers and James Harden. We didn't know Minnesota was going to be top, top notch. And we didn't know OKC was going to be top notch, but they there and they young. So we know that they don't have that, that two-step energy going up. forward as far as like playoff experience. Now we know they lethal, but at the same time with the vision that we have and the young core that we have, bro, I'm not scared we of nobody in the play in a one game scenario. Fuck the Lakers and fuck the Warriors. Hey, hey but right now it's all about the politics. Okay. I mean, uh, Golden State going just coming back. They gonna get all the calls down the stretch. We ain't gonna get none of the calls. So we got to come out here every game and do them like we just did the Cavaliers, bro, and, and, and not make it a doubt, bro. We already know our players ain't been getting the calls all year, bro. It's gonna get even worse down the last 15, 16 of the year, dog. It's gonna get even worse, bro. J Dog, what's up, J Dog? Salute, bro. Salute, Jim. Salute to you, man. What's good with y'all, man? General salute, man. What's good, man? How you like that win tonight, Jedi? What you got, man? Oh, man, look, man. Hey, you feel me? I ain't, you know, I ain't for the coming here gloating, but hey, man, we got people on this team that can get it done, bro. I, I hate LP went down, bro. 
having a hell of a year. But at the same time, man, it's a it's an opportunity for these young guys to show to show you what they what they can do on their own merit, bro. Like you've been saying. And um some big Steve said early in the season, bro, them them early losses, bro, gonna 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 help us in the long run, bro. You know, it's gonna make us a better team. And so now you seeing these guys coming out, smashing the gas and staying on that some bitch. You know what I'm saying? And so ain't no more of that let down shit, you know. And I'm gonna tell you, bro, a, 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 a dog is his most dangerous, bro, when it's wounded. And we wounded, bro. We down LP, we down Tar Eason, and we down goddamn Ken Whitmore, bro. So guess what? Everybody ain't no more looking to the next motherfucker. Now you gotta do it, bro. You feel what I'm saying? Your number one option down. So guess what? Jalen coming out, he's showing, hey, I think I'm a number one option too. So he playing like it, bro. We already know Jalen play good in the second half of the season. He played better. I ain't gonna want to say he played good. He played much better. And it's 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 it's, it's players in the past, bro, in the league. This those superstars. The second half of the season, they go crazy, bro. This ain't no new shit. Jalen, it ain't nothing new to Jalen. This some you know some players just like that, bro. Second half of the season, they they really get into they into their bag and they catch their second win and they really. The game is, is more uh polished, you know what I'm saying, second half of the season. So now nah, Green Man, no none of this surprised me, bro. This is why I wanted another big man on the on the team that could run. It's not because I want to replace LP. I don't want people thinking this shit. We got a lot of uh, uh, options on this team, bro, that's not really shooters, but they can get out in transition, bro, and make shit happen, bro. And on the defensive end, when we able to switch one through five. Bro, we, we we crazy. We crazy with it, bro. We speed up the tempo, and you ain't got to be no knockdown shooters. When you get out in transition, you're able to get stops and get on the break. You don't need no – I mean, you're going to need them eventually in the playoffs, yes. It'll show because the game slowed down. That's when LP really becomes that guy that you need him to be. But, right, but in the league right now, bro, we got so many wings, so many athletic guys on this team that can run and get out and run and do a lot of things with the ball. You feel me? Other than just shoot. You feel what I'm saying? So I wanted us to take advantage of that. That was my whole thing, you know, with getting a big man here that can run and, and, and play defense, you know, at a high level. You feel me? So, but yeah, man, um, you know, uh, uh, we've been saying this all year, man. We got talent on this team. We got a lot of players on this team that can get it. All they need is opportunities, bro. You know, we got a, we got we, some people say we got too much talent. I don't believe it. Your ass on, nigga. Fuck you doing? My fault, man. But uh, yeah. But uh, you know, I just I just thank Greenleaf, man. You know, we wound it, bro. And 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 it's it was it was an opportunity for everybody to, to kind of get in where they fit in, bro, and show you they worth. And that's what's that's what's happening right now, man. And you see Fred worth, bro. Fred know how to sit back. See, that's up that bro. That's what I'm saying, bro. In the summertime, we talking about Fred people. Oh, we overpaid, we overpaid, Laro. We overpaid. And when we trying to tell you good fat yeah. nigga. Now I'm gonna I'm check your ass because you like to name drop me, nigga. So I'm gonna name drop that good fan. Nah, yeah, shut right up, now. nigga. Nah, you gonna right now. Now you gonna get checked, nigga. So Laro, we overpaid for Fred. You know why we ain't overpaid for Fred? Cause he a leader. He know how to get in where he fit in. He know how to hoop and shoot that bitch when he need to. He Let know how to sit name, back bro. and let other niggas. Man, shut your ass up, nigga. Let he know shut how to your shoot. ass up, nigga. Nigga, let me get my shit because out, bro. Kind of being I a let your pussy ass talk it I ain't called that. your name one time, dog. Yeah. Just chill out. Just, just, get your take, dog, but, and get on, get it on with. Get your take, bro. Nigga, you call my name every night, nigga. Shut up. No, I don't. So get your take, bro. So great. So, man, look at this, nigga. You can't stop my flow, nigga. Anyway, Green, my point <laughs> is with Fred, with, with Fred Van Fleet. Yeah, he, that's what he want to do, Big Steve. You want to stop my flow? The point is, bro. <laughs> Again, Fred Van Fleet, bro, he's he, he's very intelligent, bro. He he know when to shoot yes, and he, he know is. when not to shoot, and he keeps our team locked in right. and getting the best positions uh, available to us, bro, and getting the most out of our position. So, yeah, man, that's why I wanted him, bro. It ain't so much him just being a knockdown score, all that shit. He a leader, bro. A leader got to know when to sit back and he got to know when to insert himself. That's what that's why I like Fred, bro. 
So yeah, it's uh, my take though, Green. I right, I right, cool. So uh he gave a take. Hey I man, it's been plenty of nice. I done sat back and chilled in the chat when I done heard that J Dog. You know what? Laro is right. You know what? I decided not to come up. I ain't got a glow on it. You know what? I'm gonna, I'm gonna tell you this, man. J Dog, he was right. Twin, man, he's a beast. He's not a point guard. I gave a cup of Scotty Pippen earlier. You probably wouldn't hear to hear that, but I I, I was trying to I give you props. It. I was trying to give you props by saying, nigga, you was fucking right. Man, we ain't got to argue. Green, Green said I was right. Nigga, you ain't say shit. Hey, bro, hold on. Can, can I finish, bro? <laughs> I, I, I'll let you go. <laughs> nah, nigga. I'll let you go. Because hey, you know what? The he, last if, thing if, I want, If I, mean, I can't hit the link, nah, nigga, I need you to understand I, something. I, I, that's, I, why, I, that's why I need you to say something. Because you don't stop name dropping. Well, dog, nigga, I listen to the screen, nigga. Hold up, man. It's my motherfucking time. Y'all niggas keep the order in the motherfucking line. Green, give me that motherfucking shit, man. <laughs> the, the, the prince, bitch. Say the prince yeah, gonna calm your ass down. Nigga. It's calm the weekend, prince. Calm down. Oh, yeah, there you go with that old bullshit. This nigga, nigga Lord. Green, Look on, shit, nigga. Get your shit out. Hey, 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 hold on. Let the prince get his shit out, right? What's up, dude, the prince? Hey, man. come here squabbling. They come here squabbling. Hey, nigga. Hey, y'all up, my family. Y'all can't get rid of me. It's just like that, man. But let me say this, Green. This going to be a uh -oh. hot motherfucking take. You understand? Oh, me? shit. Oh, Jalen Green is a super. All right, hold up. <laughs> Jalen Green is a star, fam. I took the uh, super off, Green. I took well, it off. I caught hold myself. I caught yeah. myself, Green. Jalen yeah. Green is a star. I don't care what nobody <laughs> say, homie. He's showing and proving. The last. Nine games now. He averaging 25 points a game. He's showing up when we need him most. Al P's out. He's stepping up to the plate. He hit yep. home runs. He leading the team. And he performing on the defensive end. He being aggressive like I wanted him to do or going to the hole. He finishing yep. at the rim. He getting and ones. He knocking down his triple. He knocking down his jumper in the midi. Bro, he assisting. Bro, stop with the yes, cap, fam. I never man, get your glow on, on, fam. Get your glow on, on, fam. Go ahead. I'm saying, get your glow on, fam. Go ahead. Prince, right now, fam. Come on, Larry. That nigga lit up over there, bubbles. Yeah, bubbles, nigga. Where you at, bubbles? Hey, dog, you know me, fam. Hey, but now, real talk, man. Uh, green. I gotta say this real quick, and I'm gonna let y'all get it on, fam. I'm watching the battle shit. Chad Ocho Cinco was talking that shit on the Breakfast Club and on mm -hmm. Nightcap. He showed mm -hmm. up at the event. He just battled Charlie Clips and DNA both at the same time. I'm loving mm -hmm. it. But let me say this here, Green. Ime Udoka, my nigga, is a mm -hmm. top five coach in the NBA, mm -hmm. bro. He done turned us around. He got all of them boys playing ball. He had a clip last game when he was mic'd up. He was still coaching Armand Thompson, telling his ass, I don't need to tell you to run. This is what you're supposed to do. You 19, 20, my nigga. You got enough energy in them legs to yeah, run two yeah. or three games straight. I love Ime Udoka. I love the Rockets. I love my Green Leaf family. We rocking, you understand me? And this ref beside of Prince, I'm listening. I'm on mute, Green. <laughs> that boy say that ref beside of Prince. You know how it is? That tequila go yes, like a motherfucker. Yes, sir. <laughs> Keela, yo, fire, boy. Keela. Hey, I will, I, I will say one thing. Down the stretch, man, we need a little Kevin Garnett out of, out of Barry, dog. I mean, I got to say it. I ain't trying to just drag us down. We got the dub. Y'all all uh, agree, dog. We need, we, we need, uh, 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 go ahead. Yeah, you got it. Hey, shout out to the Prince, man. General salute, Prince. Hey, hey, oh, uh, James, what's up with the Gene? <laughs> yep, yep, yep. Um, bless up, everyone, man. Bless up. Who's the guy that said, salute, um, Jalen Green was, who's the guy that said Jalen Green was a star just now? That was the Prince. The Prince. That was the Prince. Okay. <laughs> Yeah, man, I gotta, I gotta, I gotta say, um, he's playing like one right now. I'll give him that. Um, and we all know, we always know he has, he's a star talent, but he's trying to, he's trying to put it together. Um, now I want to see him continue this because, bro, I keep saying it, bro. Jalen Green continues if his jump shots come, comes around, he's gonna be, he, he could be a star in the league. I mean, it, it, that's just the difference because he's got everything else, you know. He's got the speed. 
Um, he's got the athleticism. If the shot is consistent, I think he's he, he could put it together, you know. So, yeah, he playing he playing like our number two pick right now, you know, and that's what we want. You know, Jalen Green hitting his ceiling is only good for the Rockets, you know. So, it, 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 I, I'm liking the way he's, he's playing. My only question now, <laughs> I know this is going to come up at some point. I wanted to save this for the post-game show, bro. <laughs> but um, does Jalen Green play better with, with, with space um, without um, somebody clogging the, the lane? And it's a real question because I'm telling you, it's different when Jalen Green doesn't have um, somebody um, in the paint in his way. Like LP. As opposed to when, he, yeah. So uh, that's my only question. Is he going to be able to play? Are they going to are they gonna find a balance when LP um, and him roll together, you know, because... Is a question if if Alp if Alp can stretch his game out to the three point shot to the three point line get a better um, three, I think it's gonna be good for Jalen as well because he's gonna have more space to operate. You know, if if Alp's game is gonna be stuck in the paint, I think it's it 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 it, it is gonna be in the way of Jalen a bit. So I'm hoping that Alp stretches his game out to the three where he can they can play five out because that opens the lane for Jalen and I, and I mean. As your number two pick, you got to play to his strengths as well. And his strength is that he needs to get downhill. He needs space in the paint to operate. So, you know, I'm Jeez, liking what I'm saying. I don't want to mean to interrupt you. You're going to continue to cook. But that's going to be on Ime Udoka, bro. He got to figure out how to make Jalen and Al P play together, fam. That's on Ime Udoka. I want to see it. Yeah, that's going to prove if yep. he's really a great coach. If he can get those two players, our two best players, to play together, fam. I, I don't right. mean to interrupt you. I'm sorry, bro. But go ahead and cook. Yeah. yeah, I mean, I mean, that's that's gonna be the, the icing on the cake now to get those two to play well off each other because what we do want is Jalen Jalen looks better when LP's off the floor, and LP looks better when Jalen is off the floor. We 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 need them to both find a way to to play well together. So that that's why I'm saying it's gonna be an LP to get his game out to the three-point line. Because if he brings his, his three-point shot up, then he can be effective not only in the paint, but he can, he can, he can, sometimes he can play outside of the paint. So hey, it's a bit on Ime hey, and also LP as well, man. But that's hey, what friend, I thought. Hey, hey, hold up. Everybody, let me, let me ask y'all this. The way Twin been playing these last few games, I'm not even sure that LP and Jalen are our best few uh, players. Now, we got, I mean, Twin been playing ball, bro. Like, I mean, Twin, I mean, Twin and, 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 and Jalen played goddamn, like, perfectly together, bro. I mean, I know what I said early in the season and whatnot, but Amin Thompson, bro, that dude is balling out of control right now, man. And I hate to have Cam out right now because I don't want to see, like, Bullet getting minutes and all that. And even though Jay Shante came in and he balled to, tonight or whatever, right? But man, bro, we got everybody healthy, bro. We have a pace that's like elite right now, bro. With a man and Jalen running up the floor. Barry, you need to play, man. If you can transplant, transplant Kevin Garnett, like heart in your chest or whatnot, I would love to see that, man. Because y'all the same size. When y'all came out, Damn, bro, I mean, you fucking long with it, nigga. Get to your point, nigga. Damn. I mean, I'm making my point, by the way. I, I'll let you go. What I'm saying is, I'm not saying, right? Long I'm saying right ass, now, nigga. look, I'm, I'm finna pencil it in right now I'm, I'm, with a pencil, bro. <laughs> a man Thompson, I, I gave a player comp at halftime, bro. He looked like a Scotty Pippen right now. So go ahead, bro. Hey, real quick. Real quick. Okay, okay, G, and then I'm, I'm gonna go, I'm gonna yeah. go to G Money next, and then I got Rich yeah. Base that want to cook. So go ahead, go real go, go, quick, G. What you got, bro? Yeah, real quick. I'm, I'm gonna, I'm, I'm, I'm gonna take back that, um, that last take. J Dog, um, Green, uh, what's his name? Jalen Green will get the two twenty if he, if he continues to play like this. So I'm, a, I'm a step back on that one seventy. If he continues to play like this, the two twenty is on the table, bro. Mm -hmm. G Money, what you got on the G Money? What's up with the Real G Money? Talk. Real talk. What's going on? What's going on? What's shaking the bacon, cool cats? What's going on? What's up with it? Man, it was a rocket launch tonight. I mean, everyone just pretty much brought into the piece of the pie. Jabari Smith, yeah, he could be a little bit better as far as being strong. Still, he plays steady. Um, and man, Thompson, hallelujah, amen. He was 
He was great tonight. Getting to the rack. His jumper was flowing. He was amazing. Fred Van Fleet was steady. Jalen Green, man, the green machine was on. I mean, he was sliced into the rack like, like Rockefeller. His athleticism was off the charts. His three ball was wet like rain. He played stupendous, though. Jeff Green was steady. Everyone just would stay. Dylan Brooks, man, Brooks is tough as nails, man. The Brook crook wasn't phased, and he was amazing. Their defense was locked down for most of the game. Did a good job fighting through the screens. Uh, stagger screens, did a good job contesting shots. And Emma Yudoka deserves a whole lot of praise right now because right now he's putting the team in the right position. And you guys are sizzling five straight wins. And, hey, there's still a glimmer of hope of you squeaking into the playing party. Still some hope. Only now three games back of the Warriors. So the Rockets right now are cooking at the right time. And you got to love it, though. Did a great job on Spider Mitch, uh, uh, Garland, and everyone. And that's why the Rockets come away with this W. Already, G-Money. Like if Jalen Green's supposed to be like like I always wanted Jalen Green to play like this with LP. You know what I'm mm -hmm. saying? And and the way that he made your doka scheme of things as far as like his defensive mindset and tenacity of what he's got going, you know, we more faster. Jabari at the five now. Like mm -hmm. I got my dispute about by Jabari's play as well, but he had a good game. You know what I'm saying? Overall, yeah, yeah, yeah. we can we can look at the stats and say he had a good game, right? And also the I, I watched the whole game. Also I watched the whole game. You believe I watched the whole game. Mm -hmm. For me, so, I don't just look at stats. I look at eye tests because the stats do not tell the story. It's the eye test. Right. Right. So oh, it's God. like what you what you seeing that what what they doing because that's not gonna tell the whole story about what they really mm -hmm. doing. What you seeing? So mm -hmm. that's true. That's like the whole moral story about these young dudes or like 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 stepping up to a certain degree. So like even the Bruce got it started, then Fred Van Vliet got it cooking. And then you see Jalen putting up his stats. I didn't even feel like Jalen was cooking. I was just looking like, okay, he, you know, being a productive, productive, productive guy. You know what I'm saying? Doing the game, letting the game come to him, not shot jacking, not overshooting his team, teammates, and stuff like that. And then you look at how it all played out at the end. We blew these boys out the water, bro. Hey, Rich. Mm -hmm. Hey, stay right there. Stay right there, G. Real Money, quick, man. Green, real quick before you go to the next guest. Let me say this about Bar. You know, I got to defend my boy, man. Mm -hmm. What people miss, to, I don't know if people really watching the games. I don't want to uh, uh, be a motherfucking me. Uh, I don't know what the word, but I don't want to disrespect nobody by saying they don't watch the game. But defense ain't sexy, bro. Jabari playing defense, fam. He getting blocks at the rim. He 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 defending, bro. So what he not doing on the offensive end that's that's sexy, right? The unsexy shit is the defense that he's playing. I just want to throw that in there real quick. Nah, and, and you know what, Green? Before you go to the next one, I'm gonna throw this one in. Uh, we not talking about his defense. We talking about how weak he be going up with the ball. Sometimes that's all we be saying. He be going up. He, got a, he, jump. he got a monster dunk in traffic, Laro, tonight. Did he not? He did, but that All was right, like the first the two. Part. I mean, we watching the game. That was like the first two, three minutes of the game. He went up with a lot of weak shots, bro, and we all see it. He need to he need to get a Lero, little bit. He got a he got a put back layup off a rebound. Did he or did he not? In traffic. He did his thing, but aye, we would aye. like to see a little <laughs> bit more. Out of Jabari, man. We need it, bro. We need it. Go ahead, hey, Green. You got hey, it. Hey, 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 Rich. What's what's happening, Rich? What's good with you, Rich? Salute, salute. Salute, salute. Larry. What's up? Larry, what's up? Long winded ass, nigga. Salute to everybody. Nigga. Hey, man. Get your take off, dog. <laughs> <laughs> nah, man. Shout out to Champagne Poppy, man. Drake, man. Court size of so that boy, Jalen Green. Put on one time. You know what I'm saying? Uh, I'm going to just keep it out way, G. I did not see the game, dog, but I did see a few bits of the highlights. Um, from what i seen in highlights, I mean, it's always going to look good in highlights. But uh, Jalen look assertive. You know what I'm saying? And I think somebody just said about Hey, Rich, I'm going to start treating you like Mars, dog. Why would I do, bro? What the hell I say? I just, I'm giving, I just gave him props. <laughs> I just gave the nigga props. Hey, man, I just gave... Hey, nah, man, nah, nah, nah. For Jalen, I'm talking about the team, nigga. Oh, I, nah, man. What, what you mean hey, when you I said... You come in coming up. Oh, man, I ain't watch the game. We know Miles don't watch the games at all. 
But at least, nah, at least, man, at least I, you aware. At least you aware. I'm gonna just keep it out. <laughs> now nah, I'm gonna just keep out of way, G, bro. It was an early game. I knew they played today. I thought it was tonight. I I didn't know it was an early game. I just so happened to um uh, look on my Instagram. I seen Drake was at the game sitting next to Tim, and I was like, "What the hell?" I'm like, "Oh, they play early." So that's that's the only reason why I knew they played. Hell, I wouldn't even I'm been not, on this stream. I'm just I'm just fucking with you, though. No, nah, I know, I know, but not, but now, but now, man. I, I, <laughs> I, I said one thing. I said it was gonna show me something. I, I circled this Cleveland game, bro. It was this Cleveland game. I was like, okay, I want to see how they look against a superior team, a playoff team. Like they, like mm -hmm. let's, let's let's just be honest. Cleveland been rolling this year, bro. That's, you know what I'm saying? Third, they third in the East. Mm -hmm. and, 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 and the most important thing to me was they was healthy. You know what I'm saying? I wanted to, I, I wanted to see them dominate a healthy, high caliber playoff team. Cleveland ain't no slouch, bro. You know what I'm saying? I, I, you know what I'm saying? So I wanted to see how the whole team looked. And I'm, from the highlights, what I seen, they was assertive. What Jalen was assertive. And uh, this is what we've been wanting to see from Jalen. I've been down on him the whole year. And I got to get him. Well, let me ask you this, though, bro. What's up? Is that play, is that play in creeping up on your mental? We only, what, three and a half games out now, bro? I think I was it's thinking about Hello, wait. I was thinking. Hold up, wait. I was thinking about it. I was thinking about that yesterday, bro. I said if it was no other team other than Golden State, I would be like positive about it. Not saying they can't do it. It's gonna take a whole lot of luck for it to happen, man. Like Golden State's gonna have to fall off. You know what I'm saying? Like they they gonna have to lose a stretch of games. That's or just even the Lakers too. That's to... I uh I mean it, it, they they got to surpass Golden State to get into the play in. So we ain't worried about the Lakers. The Lakers can True. the Lakers can do what they True. do. No, you but the Lakers. The... Yeah, yeah. Well, yeah. We chasing we, we guys. Yeah, yeah, but we chasing guys to stay, bro. Steph Curry out, too. Steph Curry out. Oh, he out? No, he, no, he out. He back. 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 He Hey, hey, G Money, this is actually a big game for us, though. You know what I'm saying? Whether it's the uh, Lakers or the Golden State Warriors, if they lose, because they right there, they want they only uh separate each other from one game. I think the Lakers like 36 and 31, and Golden State mm -hmm. 35 and 31. We 32 now and 35, so their Golden loss State would lose. be a, a three game separation from us. Golden State got to lose, bro. Golden State got to lose. Yeah, Golden State got to lose. They, they in front of us. I want to say one thing too. After this game, you know I'm a Knicks fan. They got my Knicks on Monday too for the, the Warriors, so it could be two mm. straight L's. They got my Knicks too. And yeah, we're trying to that's hope. true. I don't forget my Knicks, Knicks are trying to stay away from the plan, and my Knicks are trying to stay away from the plan. So it's like, you know, you never know until the, you never know what may happen from now until April 14, because April 14 is when the season ends. So. If the Rockets continue to surge, their defense is getting better, their ball moving, they're, they're pushing the pace better. If they can to keep doing that and say the Warriors or even Lakers start falling off the grid, you guys may be playing the plane, and you never know. If you win the plane, you get to the playoffs. Imagine that. Yeah. Right, hey, right. Hey, hey, I was thinking about that, bro, before you go on. Uh, I was like, oh, you now, one thing, now one thing teams don't want to see, and I hate we missing an LP. And, but, but this is that season where it's looking like, we gonna Go get to a certain. We, we gonna get to a certain point when the season. We gonna lose. We gonna lose. But we gonna lose because we missing that one piece, which is RP. RP. Yeah, we, we we all know we need shooters, of of course. But one thing we wanted to see was Jalen come alive, bro. Jalen look like he coming alive, bro. That that. No, I love just, it. Rich, just, just, just you guys this. Okay. We talk. We talking hypotheticals, right? So just. This. I'm hello, thinking hello, bro, Okay. Like, okay. Just think we thinking hypotheticals, right, Rich? So if we fuck around and be A C and Denver the the number one seed, we smoke the ass in the in, in, in the regular season, right? We lose the bro. But then we, we, but we, then we, we lose it. because we ain't got that LP. dude. Right. LP. That's why I was hurt when he went down because of the matchups. Now I know right. we playing different, we playing a different type of brand of basketball as far as like being more switchable and being more run and gun type of team without LP. But when the game slows down, and we know the game slows down in the payoff, that's why LP is more, more valuable for us in that first round matchup against whoever, you know what I'm saying, against whoever. So that's yeah. just how I feel about it, bro. But 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 even more so like this though, bro. Coming next year, we're gonna be able to play two ways. So when LP do sit down, guess what? We can run and gun. So that's I think this time is most important for that. 
Cause like you just said, the game gonna have to slow down. That's that like that's what uh, that's what Denver do. You know what I'm saying? That's what Denver do. They they got a high level guard and Murray, but then they gonna. I mean, we all know Yoke is gonna touch the ball. Every and they position. got a big man Michael Porter and Aaron Gordon. Yep, and they got big man Michael Porter and Aaron Gordon. Yep. Yep, matchups matter, man. Hey, uh, Terrell, what's good, Terrell? He, Terrell, I got Terrell on the panel, and then the panel. Up, we in the post game. Nah, man, it's a, it was a good game, man. I ain't really look at it to the to the third, but I wanted to say something about uh, Genius came up with a, a good question, man. Mm -hmm. Because uh, with LP, uh, I think the answer to his question is it's it's on both of them. Jalen got to be, uh, become more consistent and a better shooter, and LP as well. If both of them become better shooters going into the off season, this team is gonna be scary going into next season. It's gonna be scary, like because. Mm -hmm. With, with the court open like that, it, not only is it going to help Jalen, but Armin become even more efficient. I, people saying Scotty Pippen for Armin, I'm looking at Penny Hardaway for Armin, to be honest with y'all. Uh, we we got stars. Somebody said that we got like three superstars on one team. Uh, but uh, only thing down the streets we're going to need, we back to the team that we were to the beginning of the year. We playing defense at a, at a super, super high level right now. I watched that third quarter, and I didn't even see the first half. But everybody switching and sticking on their man and, and, and locking down, man. Like, I'll pay Emma Yudoka right now, an extension right now, if I was the Rockets. Uh, <laughs> right he don't need <laughs> one. It's his first shit. year, bro. It's his first year. Shit. <laughs> I, 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 yeah, I'm real shit. Again, nigga. Fuck it. I, Give I, him again. I'm paying him right now. I'll pay him right now. But that that's my only take, man. Hey man, go for it. Go for first, bro. Green on, open, the, on the post. Good okay, time. open panel. Real quick, let me respond to the Jalen and Al P. This is why I say it's Eme Udoka's problem, not Jalen and Al P, because they've been playing together for two, three years now. They know how to play that pick and roll with each other, bro. It's not their problem on finding out who needs to do this and who is. It's Eme Udoka's problem to figure out, okay, we need to do this with y'all too. We need to, we need you to know when to score Jalen, or we need you to know Jalen when to go to Alpi. That's not their problem, bro. The players, they can figure that shit out. It's Eme Udoka. If you notice at the first of the year, Eme Udoka was just running straight through P. He wasn't even calling plays for nobody else, bro. So that's why I say. The players going to figure it out. They can get in the gym and work together overnight and all that shit. He made you doka. Got to figure out how to work. Now, them two now that's back. That's, that's facts to Prince. But <clears throat> even with that, though, bro, it, can, it egos got to be checked. You feel me? It, it, that's, that's that's the thing with the players, bro. Yeah, he may. Yeah, he may. He may wasn't calling plays after he seen the LP came in a certain type of way. He kind of sit back, but he was still coaching hard. He would still sit LP. He would still sit Jalen. He would still sit Jabbar. You feel me? <clears throat> what's what's what, what's different is the is the court spread out with LP being out, and Twin can actually do the things he needs to do, and he ain't got to be isolated as being a have to shoot and handle the rock. He could do other shit, be in a dunker spot, be a secondary ball handler, things like that. You know, attack closeouts and shit because he's a secondary ball handler. He ain't got to be at the top of the key with all eyes on him, bro. He can slip back, though. He got enough athleticism to take advantage of all his gifts, and the defense can't really respond to a guy with that kind of athletic ability, with that kind of quick twitch uh, muscle uh, uh, action. And so the Rockets got the best of both worlds with him and Jalen. Because now you got eyes on Jalen because Jalen is bad. But twins slipping back down on the darker spot. So when Jalen, his evolution is seeing that mismatch and recognizing. That's why the alleys are coming available to the Rockets now. That's why you're seeing all this backdoor action with, with Twin and Jabari catching out. It's it just, bro, it's a whole lot of shit when you're talking about spreading the court, bro. When LP not out there, bro, and, and yeah, we got the best of both worlds. But these guys got to learn how to play with each other, bro, at a high level. And the egos got to be checked at the door. It ain't about, uh, about you and me, my nigga. It's about us winning these goddamn games. But guess what? When we win these games, everybody get paid. Trust and believe everybody get paid, bro. Ask Golden State, bro. 
You understand what I'm saying? Go to stop one play and pay everybody. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? So real talk, like real shit. You know, everybody going to get paid. And when it's time for Armin to get paid, it'll be time for Armin to get paid. But at the same time, he cannot be. Now, when you say he might not be, I don't know who said that, but they say, you know, it ain't, ain't Jalen and LP. No, Jalen and LP, bro, when you put the ball in their hands, shit can happen. You can't put the ball in Armin's hands right now. It shit going to happen. If the defense is predicated to stopping him, he'll get stopped, bro. What the what makes him valuable? He don't have to be a guy that's that's defense focused on because he could do other things. But you still need a guy that the defense to focus on so he could do what he do. If that makes sense, you feel what I'm saying? So nah, if you put the ball in Armin, you understand what I'm saying? Yeah. So if you put the ball in Armin's hands, bro, it'll look a lot different, fam. That's why in the summer when people talking about put him at point, I'm like nah, he a wing, fam. You know, because he got he, he could play defense at a high level. The dude can handle the rock enough. And he can't shoot, but he but he athletic as fuck. And he got and he's he, he very aggressive. So you can utilize all that shit, bro. You understand what I'm saying? That's why Emay told him, I ain't gotta tell you to attack the rim, bro. At them this game 60, whatever, nigga. You you get them go to the rim, nigga. And Armor just looked at it and just kind of like, yeah, hey, you right, coach. You know what I'm saying? And walked it off. But now, nah, M.A., bro, he he, he he coached these guys hard at the beginning of the season, right? But this, but at the end of the season, he's still coaching. But he letting these guys, he took, I could tell he kind of took, took the reins off a little bit to kind of let them do their thing, bro. He kind of opened the shit up to let, them, let these guys really kind of do what they do. And, bro, they hooping. As you can see, bro, it ain't no, it, it, yeah, they hooping. And, but M.A., he did not already set the principles in place for him what to do on defense, how you want to move the ball on offense. Now, nah, bro, you got to trust your work, bro. You got to trust what you did in the lab, bro. It, it, it's going it, it's gonna to give you what you need to when it comes to uh the end and product. And that's what we're seeing, bro. He trusting these guys. He, he putting these guys on the court. It, it's, it's sad that L.P. not out there with them. But, bro, guess what? Going into next season, and if we able to sneak into this play-in situation, we're going to be so much more valuable and so much more scary and, and, and dangerous, you know what I'm saying, because of what we're going through right now. So everything I look at, bro, it, it, from a positive standpoint, I don't really look at it as a nigga because we're a young team, bro. We shouldn't be looking at shit as a nigga. Everything is, is really a learning. It's really a learning uh, 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 tool, bro, for us at this point. You That's feel what I'm saying? Like, Long as we don't regress and get into bad habits, and we're not. Look at Jalen, bro. He's not just shooting the goddamn ball. Jalen trying to get to the rack, and if he can't get to the rack, he kick it back out to Fred. He kick it back out to whoever. But Jalen not playing crazy. He's not playing like he got low IQ no more, bro. He playing like a total basketball player. He getting offensive rebounds. You understand what I'm saying? Like he doing a lot of shit. He playing big. He playing aggressive. He's more assertive, bro. Like it's a whole lot of different different it's a whole lot of different aspects to Jalen's game other than just shooting the damn thing is what everybody said he was than what he than, than what hey, hey, than, than what hey. than what he did last year bro he whole hey. you know you're a totally different player bro I'm not gonna ask hey Jada I said it at halftime you know what, what? Jalen was an efficient four for eight bro and I'm like mm -hmm. damn Jalen got all these ports he got nine rebounds at the half. I mean, he was doing his thing, bro. I mean, you know what mm -hmm. the thing is? It is all on email, like other people said. And you know what? Fuck it. You were right. I gave the player comp, comp, uh, comp at Scotty Pippen. He's not he a Penny Hardaway. Saying. Penny he Penny got, Hardaway was a was a point <coughs> guard who was damn near like it. a uh, who was damn near like a uh, uh, Irvin Magic Johnson, bro. Real talk. Hey. But the thing is. Yeah. The only reason why they they, they are player company because he came out as a point guard. I'm not trusting overtime elite and all that who had him at that. <laughs> I mean, he was like playing against lesser than comp competition or whatnot, right? He's not right. like a true. He's probably not a true point guard at this point. But and I'm not even looking at him like that, bro. That mm -hmm. dude is balling, bro, and he plays off Jalen like a basketball cheat, bro. is positionless, bro. 
Not point guard, yeah, point not guard, really. Guard, I mean, what other position? Tanner. I mean, the here's only, the thing, though. The only position. I don't need Al P shooting threes. Oh, hold on. Let me let me but finish, and you got it. Let me finish. You got I, it. I, I, just, I just want to throw that in there. Um, All right, let me finish. You got player, it, bro. He's a bad. I need player. look. I, I need forty five seconds, bro. Let, let me say this. Let me say this. I don't need LP shooting threes, bro. I don't need him to be working on the three, bro. LP is good where he is. The thing is, it's up to e like everybody been saying, to just make all this, just combine together, bro. I mean, you can't run all the time because somebody yeah, can slow you down and take <coughs> advantage of you, dog. Let me help him. Be good around him, bro. Has to, it, remember, basketball is a team game, bro. If LP doesn't stretch his game out to the three, it affects other players on the team like Jalen, bro. Talk, Gene. So now we need five, two, three now, bro. The game doesn't change that much. So we need five. He got to become a better shooter, bro. He got to become a better shooter. Yes, if you, if you, if you watch the game, yes. Knock a down a three, Lero. He don't yes, have to if you be a the knock game, down bro. shooter. He has to be able to knock down a shot. That's yeah. what we saying, bro. Hey, and and he got to be hey, confident with this shit, bro. He got to be They Jabari Smith at the center, right, Jed out, And he shot three three. Jabari, twenty points. How many did points. he make, Green? Two. He made did three. He, he was three, three for five. He was three for Come five tonight. Now, yeah. yeah. now hold up. When I said the other hold on, wait a minute, hold on, hold on, wait a minute. I'm not gonna let y'all get this honest. out. We talking ball right now. The other night I said move Jabari right. to the five. Now he too weak in the ass. Man, come on, y'all. Y'all can't have that. Y'all can't have it both ways. Come on, 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 y'all can't have it both ways. Uh, the kid from Phoenix or Embiid, he is too weak in the ass. But when we playing against a Jared Allen and other teams with smaller centers, smaller fives, then Jabari could work. We need Al P to play. It's 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 a balance, bro. Basketball. So you don't so hold up. Hold up. Look, hold you up don't think, you don't think that uh, that step. he needs to strengthen up. Is that yes, what you're I saying? Do. You know I said that, Steve. Big Steve, come on. Oh, okay. Jabari right. needs to add muscle. That's, That's all we're saying, saying man. Hold That's up. This is what I've been saying all oh, year. I'm saying the Rockets have two different teams, bro. We have a half a half court team with Fred and Al P. Then we have a, a running gun team when we bring in Amon, Cam, Jabari, Jalen, all of these motherfuckers that can get up and down the court, bro. That's yeah. what I'm saying. So we got to learn how to that's why I say it's on e may e may got to learn how to mix this shit in together and make but the prince you don't think he may doing a good job, bro? Because yeah, this yeah, out, this out, this injury did the, the, the flip the script with e may and he's showing like hey, bro, we on a win streak and on the road, you know, we produce on the road, even though that's what we've been whining about, crying about like producing on the road. But LP is a big deal, I don't give a damn what we win. Hell we, we yeah, no he he's doing an exceptional job, bro. I love the job. He's okay, doing. yeah, but yeah. he still yeah, has right. to. He, I mean, it's this is a new team for him too, Green. He don't know what he, he's finding out what Jalen could do in the open court. He didn't know Al P could do this in the half court. So what he has to do is balance it out, bro. You dig what I'm saying? That's what I'm nah, saying. Yeah. Uh, nah, when we get that. in the playoffs, Al P game gonna be. The best thing for us because it's a slower paced game in the playoffs, bro. But when we trying to win games in the regular season, we got to get out in space and let our Jalen's and Alpes, yeah, we I, I mean, Jalen's and ass, Alma, yeah, we got a match on them, bro. They young, they energetic, they spry, they can run. That's what I'm saying. So Alpes is going to be perfect for the playoffs, bro. And and, and mm -hmm. when we play the biggest ass out too. Tell him I stop talking. Hey guys, to you. I said I'm about to do more than talk to you, motherfucker. <laughs> be Steve. <laughs> Go on, me, be Steve. I got you, though. This thing be Steve. He at the J, man. He he behind the scenes doing some shit. Now go keep cooking the print. The print, you know. Um, oh, I was on mute, Green. My bad. I was on mute. I'm just happy to be up here, Green. You know, I'm just on that rest beside so I might butt in here and there. You understand me? I'm just loving to be up. No, no, no. You was cooking. You was cooking. I had to, I had to uh, put Big Steve on mute real quick because I know he, he probably still at the J handling business, getting on the nigga head. Yeah, 
Yeah, yeah. I'm, I'm gonna be the I'm gonna be the horse of the stream tonight, Green. You know that. Yeah, you know. The stream, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah. Oh shit. I'm gonna get on Laro ass because he been talking about trade Jayla, trade Jayla. Man, man, look, man. Hey, hold up, hold up. Hey, hey, hey. Since we talk, since since since, since that since, since that's the case, how y'all feel about Jalen Green out playing Donovan Mitchell tonight? Nine for twenty from the field for Jalen Green, twenty six points, and Donovan Mitchell hey, tonight, four for 13, 13 points. Man, how y'all feel about? That? Hey, the thing is, I want to say about that is this. Oh, let, let me get it. I want to say about this. Uh, we had our young Scotty Pippen on our team. His name is mm-hmm. Amin Thompson. I see y'all call him twin now. That's because of me. Let me tell you something, though. <laughs> he was locking goddamn uh, that dude up all night. He even made Tristan Thompson elbow his ass in the goddamn nose that kept him out for the last uh, third quarter. <laughs> I mean, the last of the third quarter, bro. Like, real talk, bro. Amin Thompson is a lockup dude. Man, I got my player comp as uh, Scotty Pippen. He is not a penny hard away, by the way. But, man, that dude can ball. And I think if you measure him right now, he probably 6'9", dog. Look at his man, brother, bro. Measure, man. Man. They, got his brother, they got his brother listed at 6'10", so he got to be the same. I'm like, telling I'm, you, dog. Oh, he, nah. I told y'all at halftime, bro, He they growing, bro. I mean, he already bigger than Jalen Green when they came Green, in, dog. Green, they bro, them, those dudes growing, court. bro. They growing, 16. dog. They growing, bro. They growing, yeah, they bro. He was towering over. He made you doke in that clip. He was towering over. And, and hey, he G- made like six six. Mm-hmm. Yeah, he was towering over him, bro. <laughs> nah, but but the way he played, bro, he like 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 I know that's your boy, uh, the Prince. But at the same time, when it's a it's a, it's 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 a too big of a difference when you see Armand Thompson catching the ball in the dunkers position and then Jabari Smith Jr. times. Nah, that's that's why point. like we on Jabari here, like bro, you too, you too, you know what I'm saying, too lengthy, you too tall to be, you know what I'm saying, going up timid at times. Like, like, like yeah. punch the rim. You know, Armand Thompson you gonna see, do that. Man, he's six seven. Yeah. I agree, Green. I agree. Green, you need to say it, dog. You too big to be playing that soft. He got to get some more weight yeah, on man. Green. He got to get some muscle. He got to get, just some, gotta get some muscle, him. man. Yeah, That's it. Yeah. But, but Armin Thompson not too bigger than him. He's 6'7". Nah, Armin, you right. can see they... they hey, dog, they, he ain't 6'7", no, 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 no more, bro. Armin got more muscle in his heart. Yeah, hell yeah. Armin got more muscle in his heart. Armin got more muscle in his heart. Hell yeah. He'll push his heart ass down. You think... uh? The uh, the matchup that we seen tonight with Donovan Mitchell four for thirteen shooting thirteen points from Donovan Mitchell, uh, and Jalen Green shooting nine for twenty tonight with twenty six points. You know he had guys running around here saying like we should trade Jalen Green for guys like Donovan Mitchell. How you feel about this matchup tonight? Well, tonight Jalen Green was Donovan Mitchell's papa tonight. It was going to the rack. He did a good job defensively. Spider Man put took him out of his game. Mitchell looked wiggity wiggity whack in this game. Also. Jalen Green took the right shots. J- Jalen Green wasn't trying to be umpy jumpy. He took the right amount of shots. He took shot. He took. Sh- he learned to pass the ball, and his min and his three point shot was just amazing. He he totally showed Spider Man was boss. By the way, Greenleaf, I have my number in the private chat. Just want to throw it out there. I have my number in the private chat if you want it. Greenleaf. Okay, I got and you. Also, I got you. Thank you. And also, and also. Jalen Green did a good job letting the game come to him. He wasn't trying to be a hero. He wasn't trying to do anything out of the ordinary. He just let he let the game come to him, and that's why he totally, totally, you know, curb stomped Don and Mitch. And think about this. You guys have an easy schedule coming up. Wizards, Bulls, Jazz, Blazers. Come on, man. Like, you got – Thunder will be tough. We got Jazz. OKC twice, though. We got OKC twice. No, we got one, one more time. Game. No, this is one more time, Lero. We just one more time. We got one more time. Then you got Dallas. Dallas is inconsistent on the road. I mean, Minnesota without Cat. Who knows? Golden State. You never know how that. That's a big game right there. Should be honestly should be a TV game right there. Home against Miami. Hey. Miami's been such a frantic. Dallas. Who knows? Orlando. Who knows where the Magic are at? Jazz, Blazers, and Clippers. You guys have a real good shot to get to the play in. A really good shot. Yeah, I'm gonna, I'm gonna, I'm gonna make, I'm gonna pay attention to the game tonight, especially with the Lakers and Warriors going down tonight. Uh, Stephen Curry coming back. Want to see how that looks? But uh, yeah, man. Uh, we on that stretch where how many games left? Fifteen games left, and we only three games out. 
and uh, we just four, gotta hold up. 15, 15, 15, 15. Get three yeah, games 15. out. 15 games. Hey, okay, hey Green, so, I just read uh I just watched mm-hmm. the video saying uh, Jay, uh, Jay, uh Green from uh Golden State. He said he's Green. no longer having fun. So that might be oh, yeah. a, a big problem might, for them. Might be a telltale sign of them not being really focused, huh? And why tell Alan yeah. Silver, bro? Stop, start rocking with these, rocking with them old ass players uh, going forward, bro. Produce your young players, dog. You know what I'm saying? Go and put them out there, bro. Get them up out. I'm tired of seeing Golden State in the, in the, in the, in the goddamn Lakers in the play-in since this shit happened. These niggas taking it easy breezy, and these young teams really fight for some shit. Go and get them up out of there, bro. And they got more talent. They Hall of Fame was trying to in the play in. Let the let, let the young dogs be in the play in. G money. I know what you mean. And here's what kills me too, right? Of Adam Silver. Why is the freaking Grizzlies on TV and the Spurs? What the heck, man? <laughs> oh I'm hell no! Nah. See, see, the disrespect TV, is man. real. The disrespect is real. It is, and I'm a Knicks fan, mind you. It is. I know. I know how it feels. The thing with Adam Silver is this: if you want your range to go high, show teams who have a real shot making the playoffs. The Grizzlies are banged up. They're in the walking wounded, though. So, like, why, why, is the, why is the Grizzlies and Warriors on TV over the Sixers and the Suns? That's ridiculous. It, like, come on. You know, you know what I mean? The, the Rockets just have right. more TV games. Other teams should be on TV more. Not the freaking Spurs and Hornets and Grizzlies and teams like that. Like, come on. I agree. I agree, man. They 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 can switch up any type of TV schedule just like they did for us. Uh True. I think a couple of times this year. So they can do that with the TV schedule. You know what I'm saying? Uh mm-hmm. all these other ESPN analysts, y'all could talk back. They supposed to be basketball savants. So it don't matter what the what the what the schedule is. You know what I'm saying? The schedule can be switched up. Can you talk hey, basketball? Green. Uh, uh, hey, hey Green, I know problem. you know what it feel like, but take this out. Imagine what it's gonna be like eventually next year when a Jalen Green get those calls, bro. Oh, he's going to be 25-5-5, Lero. 25-5-5, Hey, Lero, if that... 35 and 5. Yeah, because I was about to say, I was about to say, Big Steve, Lero, then nigga Jalen Green, the inefficiencies, them, them them free throws can help out if you're going to the line eight times, ten times a game, being aggressive. Yeah. That's an easy, that's an easy 20. Because we all know he don't get a man out. He don't get mad. And he ain't my favorite player on the team. A man is, right? But, I mean, bro, I want to see that dude be a star. I want to see him make the playoff game next year, bro. I mean, the, uh, the all-star next year, bro. But, hey, so, Laro, you might well give me my $100 then because you know Jalen Green going to get that, 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 that max contract <laughs> this, this summer. You thought I forgot, huh? Yeah, I want that $100 or uh, that max contract Jalen going to get this summer. And, and you know what I'm saying? We ain't going to trade him. That's what you're saying, huh, Laro? You see the light. I mean, right what now. I'm saying you know what is, saying? if if Rafael Stone signing for a, a dollar less than that max, you owe me a hundred dollars, right? <laughs> hey, he gonna hey, he right. gonna sign no, that two hundred million. Right around. Right. He gonna get that two hundred. Hold on. He gonna get that two hundred. Hold on. Hold on. Hold on. If he signing for a dollar under the max, you owe me a hundred, right? No, no. I want to. I want. I want to say Jaden Green signed for a max extension. That's we all know the max. The max is five years, two twenty. If he signed for no, a dollar no, less no, than no, that, nigga, you owe me a hundred, bro. That's what that's what LP. Jaden Green match could be five years, two sixty now. <laughs> he ain't I getting said, that, bro. I said, I he said, ain't no, getting that, bro. He, he might he might not get that, but I'm just saying that's what his. No, he ain't can. not getting that. I'm saying he gonna get that two hundred. So if you want to put, we didn't make a bet about the two hundred plus. <laughs> we just said a max extension, and I said he gonna get the max. Hey man, you know what? A hundred dollars don't make or break me. All I want to see is up uh, make the goddamn playoff next season, dog. Fuck all that, but that fuck all that bullshit, bro. I mean, nah, yeah, okay. Nah, you'll change, you'll change, your, you'll change your mind for the stream over with, nigga. Nah, I ain't made my mind, J Dog. <laughs> I said you'll change your mind for the stream. Oh, hold up, J Dog. We on the same side more than we on against each other, bro. On the cool, fuck you all that. You said some shit the other but, day. Man, you said some shit hey, earlier. They I agree bro. with you. That's one. That's one out of me. Hey, 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 look, bro. Hey, man. All I want to see is us win, bro. That's all I want to see is victories, dog. I don't believe you, nigga. Oh god, (laughs) negative fool, negative fuel, you nigga. I know you. I know you. (laughs) You you like negative, nigga. You like negative shit. You like shit to talk about, Lero. 
You tell hey, somebody man, else that shit. All I'm trying to say is shit wasn't that sweet when the season began. But you know what? I'm seeing it shape up right now. You, 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 hey, hey Lero, you seen, you seen the vision now, huh, Lero? We was we was right there with you, bro. Watching these, watching the low the lull that we were going through with the road losses and stuff like that, bro. We was there, but at the same time, we didn't deflect and start condemning and start throwing right. shade and start yeah, wanting is. motherfuckers up out of here and all that bullshit. You know, <laughs> that's what make people come at you the way they come at you, bro. Because you know we don't need wishy washy motherfucker. You know, hey, bro, you I get it. I, I get it. Tim, I get Tim it. Tim you know what? Steve. I, I get it, but y'all got to admit, man, Jalen was playing soft and suspect. Yes. Doing like, the, the man, y'all, y'all got to admit that, bro. Y'all got to admit, admit that. Every stream, that's the thing. Don't act like we didn't, bro. We we got on all and, of and I know that. I know that. That's why I ain't going hard at nobody. And I'm um, giving y'all no y'all credit for sticking everybody. through with everybody, man. I <laughs> I get it, bro. If I get you, it. If you tripping, we're going to get on your ass like underwear. Plain and simple. Hey, because you know what, real talk? I remember Jay, uh, J-Dog saying like a month ago, like, man, Green, I don't know, man. <laughs> Jalen ain't showing it, right? I don't know if he do for it. I remember everything, bro. I mean, y'all... And what, y'all and what else? Hey, like, <laughs> nah, nah, don't say half of it, nigga. What else I say? <laughs> I said that if that nigga be aggressive, it will be good. But he not asserting himself right now. Did I not say that too? You did, bro. So okay, I'm well, say everything, you, nigga. I'm don't be coming at that you, you is, nigga. That's you, you slick ass. Man, you what I'm slick saying is right fuck. now, look, look, look. What? I'm down with what? my Rockets. And God. talk to shit about me, bro. I'm, I'm down with the Rockets, bro. I ain't right? talking shit about you, Larry Rope, but you got to keep. Bro, if you're going to quote me, bro, you got to quote everything. You can't come with that half shit, my nigga. That's all yeah, I'm saying, bro. Don't act like these Republicans, man. Come on now. <laughs> real, real talk. <laughs> real yeah. shit. Tell, him. tell half the story. <laughs> tell half the damn story. You feel me? Like, nah, bro, I was on Jalen ass. And what I, what I say, Lero, quote me. If I'm if I'm lying, I'm done. <laughs> what I say, I expect a whole lot of him, bro, because I know he got the shit in him. But he need to be more assertive, bro. I, did I not say that? Yeah, but one thing we, we all said about Jalen. He need to be more efficient at the cup, dog. I mean, he, his efficiency damn, his efficiency at the cup hey, is, is like still more, suspect. He got some way out of it. No, no, no. Bro. After all stuff, bro, he got a little more efficient. He's shooting eight eighty percent clip at the rim. Yeah, real shit. Yeah, to the rack, hey, they, listen, they listen to what we say, bro. Yeah, they listen, bro. They listen. For the coaching shit. Nah, it ain't about no coaching, bro. Jalen know how to play. Bro, but it may expect something else out of him besides just scoring. Jalen has Defense. learned how to give him that shit. Defense, bro. Yes. Play with play with IQ. No, yes. no when to goddamn me, uh no when to drive, no when to shoot. All that type of shit, bro. It ain't just hey, chucking the damn ball up, bro. Oh yeah, bro. Yeah. Lexi, mm-hmm. Lexi in the chat. She said you think Almond is better than Jaden right now, Green Lee. Hell no. Hell no. Hell no. Hell no. Hell no. But I know Mars nah. and Mars came over here talking about. Mr. Mars came over here and said that that Alma Thomas is a more complete player than Jalen right now. No, hey, hold on, hold on, hold on. Hey, I'm, hey. I'm not defending. I'm not defending it. But he look at the right efficiency. Look at the efficiency tonight, though. Look at, <laughs> look at the efficiency. Look, look how but, he's but, going, dog, man. That's but, why I said. But, but, no, he, no, he, no. He didn't say that he's all right. Better player than Jalen Green. That would be No, I'm not saying that. I'm not saying that. But what I'm saying is. He a fishing around the rim, bro. He finished. Narrow. He finished. around the rim. He Narrow. finished at the key cup, phrase, bro. Freaky yeah, phrase. Bro. Yeah, 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 what you got to do? The bars are going to do you then, not Jalen. You got to hit some jump shots. Lero, you know who led the team in rebounds tonight? Jalen. Probably right. Jalen. 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 The nigga is excelling on defense. Bro, I pointed it out. Passing, I po- going. He's trying to learn the whole motherfucking game. Nigga, I'm on the rep side. I'm going to get on your whole ass friend. tonight. <laughs> all right, first of all, ain't nothing to hold yeah, about yeah, me, yeah, but yeah, I'm just yeah, saying, yeah. man, he had yeah, a, he yeah, had a nice game tonight, bro. Man, you know that's how we talk in Texas, nigga. Hold yeah, yeah, yeah. I, I ain't tripping, bro. But what I'm it. saying is he had an efficient night, bro. I mean, he bro, wasn't jacking too much. for the last nine games, fam. Yeah, I've been here he watching it, dog. He been on it, bro. Stop, bro, nine games. But, that, that, that's, but but you cannot you cannot say 
that that's a correct statement that he's a better all around player than Danny Green. No, no. There's certain things, certain parts of his game that yes, he's ahead of Jalen Green in that aspect. But right now, no, that would be an asinine comment. But man, twins going at a fucking clip right now. That's elite, bro. God damn. Oh, I mean, he's still, he's still, he's still averaging basket, maybe, what, eight, maybe, he, maybe averaging 16 to 15 points a game, bro. And, and hold up. The thing is. It, 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 from three, fam. Hey, you know, the thing is, it's not about getting on. It's not about getting on Jalen right now. (laughs) Right now. Hold up. Right now. Hold up. Right now. I'm about getting on on Barry right now. I'm about getting out. I'm ready for Barry, bro. You really want me to turn up? You better shut your... A lot of people tell you. I've been getting on Barry. Because I know he's better than what he's showing. I wish I could see the blocks. I know he had a couple blocks. Come on, fam. Stop. Hold on. Y'all want to see it on screen? Yeah, put it on the screen, Greg. Um, we're gonna, we gonna, we gonna break nice. down these stats. Man, like, put no. it on screen when, when Barry going up weak and not contesting shit, bro. Like real talk. He out center <laughs> right, right now. Larry. You right, that bro. I, I understand that, bro. I ain't gonna lie. I leaked the stats. Jabari at 20. And three uh, blocks, Larry! Nigga! Fuck you talking about? <laughs> What about the weak ass layups he be going up with? All right, we got to talk about that. We being honest about the team. What about them weak ass layups he go up with? He don't go up strong. We need a, a better finisher around that cup right now because we don't got LP. I mean, Say, bro, he be going up weak, bro. What is eight of thirteen? What's the oh, percentage? I ain't like good at math, bro. What's, what is eight of thirteen from the field, Laro? I'm not trying like to argue. Barry needs it. Barry does not go. Barry does not bro. go up strong around the cup, bro. Am bro, I talking anything new right now? Fam. You nitpicking, bro. <laughs> you nitpicking, bro. Come on, fam. You being a man. Uh, I'm talking about making the play in right bro. now, so I'm not nitpicking, dog. So we need yeah. Barry. All the sh- he a plus twenty two. Uh, that's better than anybody else on the team. Uh, mm. only two damn. We won over. by twenty points, dog. So that don't count right now. Oh my god. Okay, so the 20 that Barry scored is the reason why we won by 20. Nigga, I can That's say not that what I'm saying. What I'm saying <laughs> yeah, yeah, is yeah. he need to play oh, stronger. Man. Come everybody on, up here, everybody, hold up, everybody up here besides you know that Barry need to play stronger around that cup, bro. He nah, need to play stronger around the cup, bro. Nah, I hate to pray. That nigga do be going up weak, bro. Cause we nah, want a rhythm bro. and it that shit lie. pissed me off. It, 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 I paused for a whole goddamn two minutes probably because of Barry. Went up south for some shit. I'm like, come on. Yes, you did. I mean, I'm right with you, bro. I'm right with you, fam. I ain't so, you. so I, I know what Larry was talking about, but like, yeah, we, like we, we, but, but at the same time, Larry, we can do that for everybody though on the team. That's right. We can do that right. for everybody, Larry. Do you remember? You remember Jalen Green in the interview saying about the uh, soft layups and miss layups and stuff like that. And when you try to duck everything. Pretty soon, you your ass might be sitting on the bench with a hurt hand, and it, mm-hmm. it does happen. Yeah. So yeah. you can't duck everything. So yeah, you can't go up, but but you, you can't go up soft. You got to have some aggression with it. You get bumped. You see, we don't get the calls a lot of the time. He will eventually get those calls, but that's that's why he tried to finesse away from some of the contact. But you can't just go up and try to dunk everything because eventually you're gonna fuck that hand up. Real mm-hmm. talk. And what I'm learning too, Green, that I got to realize, like I said, I got to concede, bro. Al P probably our best player. Jalen right behind him. And then it, it's a race. Uh, it, it could be Amon. It could be Barry. It could be Cam. We don't know. Uh, I got to concede, bro. Uh, Jabari, he still got a package. I believe he's still a good player on this team, but he's like a third or fourth option, bro. You understand? It's so gonna come I along for Jabari. Yeah, it's gonna he come gonna, along. He gonna get better, bro. Yeah, I mean, but his impact, you know, it shows volume. You know what I'm saying? When it went, went like tonight, yeah. people didn't see it from the eye test, but at the same time, we looked at the stats, and if you really paid attention to the game, like he was impactful. He was impactful, right. starting at right. the five. So, yeah, man. I mean, you know, what I'm saying it, it could be a different story for the guys like the bonuses when Al P has to guard him. Uh, mm-hmm. the Yokes of the world, but yeah. that's when Jabari has to show his offensive repertoire. It's like if they guard you, you do damage on them. Mm-hmm. That's you feel me? So, matchups does matter. That's why, like, if LP, that's why LP being off of us is a detriment right now. 
because if he's if we in the AC, nigga, I, don't, I ain't fearing no motherfucking body. I don't give a damn if it's Denver. Uh, if it if, even if we get beat by Denver, gentlemen swept, swept or not, nigga, them games gonna be tough for Denver. Bet that the Pelicans, y'all two, uh, uh, the Clippers, they got their own little story. But I'm just talking about like we we, we gonna have to be the AC if we coming out the play out play in. You feel me? Play in is just something that 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 we can upset some shit on some one two game scenarios. You know, anything can happen in a one game scenario. You know what I'm saying? So if we get solidified as an AC, if it's Denver up there, OKC up there. I'm not scared of or Minnesota up there. I'm not scared of them niggas. For what? For what, nigga? They ain't proved shit. Yeah. I seen some AC that was pro- uh, first seed that was proven and got swept. I mean, it got beat by AC that wasn't proven mm-hmm. at once upon a time. Now we're in the play in scenario. I've been saying this shit alone. I've been holding my nuts all season on. Long, I stand on bidding. They don't give a fuck who you is. I say what I say for a reason. Nigga, I'm not scared of no Minnesota Timberwolves. I'm not scared of no motherfucking OKC Thunder. I'm not scared of no, well, you know what I'm saying, Denver's all the, the Denver's is the champ. But we beat, we the only team probably got the best record against them niggas because what? Matchups matter. We got, we got dudes that can match up with them. That's my theory. That's my scenario. But our big, one of our big dogs that went down for the count, now we got to switch up. Now we got to switch up. And you know what I'm saying? Make some adjustments. But we've been doing that. Ime Yudoka been doing that. He's showing that he's a great coach. Ime. Without our offense being the top 10 offense. But our defense is what it is. Defense wins championships first and foremost, nigga. Not the offense, KD. Bitch. You niggas, hey, Green, you niggas, one, you niggas got smoked by us too. Hey, Green. One, I, one thing I will say about Ime, bro. Every halftime, every like little break and play, he coaching and he, and he teaching, bro. Real talk, he coaching and he teaching doing every break, man. He on everybody ass all the time. And Dylan, it's be you want to act? That. Yeah, real talk, Dylan. You want to act like you Kyrie? All right, come sit next to me for the next 15, 20 minutes, dog. Real talk, man, he may doing it. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. I be at the games. I be at the games. He may is, has a foul mouth. Yeah. I think I put nah, damn near my mouth, bro. You I ain't never seen nobody was saying this, but I'm talking about foul mouth, bro. I'm talking about gutter. He may get on their ass. He gets on the ref's ass. He don't give a fuck. Nah, I mean, I mean, I mean he may even say that he coaches young dudes worse than his veterans or people that I got that, that, that have play in the NBA right now. So let's let you know, like he trying to prepare his young dudes. You know what I'm saying? Going forward, because when they really mature in this league in their positions, you know, you ain't got to say too much. Why you think Popovich it, it, later on in his career, the uh, Phil Jacksons, they implemented a system, a scheme of things, a foundation. I'm going to sit my ass down. They know what it is that it takes to win the game. It's on them. I ain't got to coach shit. I coach in practice. I ain't got to coach doing a. On, but with these young dudes right now in this league and this generation, nah, I gotta stand up. My hands ain't in my pockets. I ain't got no nah, Hall tough. of Famers on my team and, and shit like that. Nah, nigga, I'm fin- I'm finna coach. When shit get rowdy, I'm finna shit the fuck up. Jaden, what the fuck you doing? Jabari, what you Alp uh Army? I ain't gotta tell you, you one. Nigga, you supposed to do that from the get-go. Why I got to get on your ass as a grown-ass man, as a 22, 21-year-old? You fucking all the bad bitches in the world. Why I got to get on you to play defense? You chasing ass, nigga. Chase the goddamn rock, nigga. <laughs> hey, what are you talking about? Yeah. Oh, hey. I mean, yeah. Bro, he told, he told the boy to stop acting like a bitch. You know hey, what I'm real like. talk. Hey, Green. I see Miss V out there. Hey, let me, let me, hey, let me uh, respond to Molly from earlier, bro. I want mm-hmm. cause, cause she, cause I know she had said that the other night too about Armin. Molly, like, I know what you're seeing in far as Armin, his game and his aggression, but his, his, his ability to do what he do is only made uh, comfortable because Jalen and Fred and those other guys 
are able to take a, attention and eyes off of off of him because they gotta they gotta. I mean, the defense takes their eyes off of him because they gotta be focused on Fred and Jalen in LP to a certain extent. So Armin is able to do the things that he do because he's so talented and his, his athleticism makes you think like, well, damn, if you just give him the ball, then he could do what Jalen do. But no, that's not the case. When, you, when you're when when you you made to be the focal point of the offense, you know what I'm saying? This is a teaching moment. When, you, when you're made to be the focal point of the offense, then the defense keys on you and they game plan for you. They're not game playing so much for Armin as they are for Fred, LP, Jalen, and, and, and those guys. You understand know what I'm saying? And so if Armin has to be the guy with the ball in his hand that got to get buckets like Jalen, you'll see a difference. And you'll see, a, a, you know, he's not going to be as effective because he can't shoot the rock. And they'll be able to sag the defense. They'll be able to play zone. And they'll basically zone up uh, or zone him up and play and play on LP and, and, and Jalen and the rest of them guys. You know what I'm saying? And just let him shoot. And see, you know, defense, their thing is, is to find the weakest leak to the offense. And when a guy can't, when he a guy has holes in his game, you know what I'm saying? The defense can exploit that over time. And so that's the thing with Armour. Armour can do what he do, but only because Jalen, Fred, and LP do what they do at a high level. So if that makes sense to you. That's why we say he's not ready, and he'll not. He's not a more complete player than Jalen, because no. Jalen he don't shoot at a high level. But J as you can see, Jalen can get hot and shoot your ass, the, the, the close the gym down on your ass. You know what I'm saying? Armor, yeah. Armor, not there yet. Jalen can get to the rack. Jalen can get his teammates involved. Armor handle is not there yet. If you if you need Armor to get your team uh, uh, into offense. He ain't he ain't ready. He's not ready to do that. He turns the ball over when he got a, a, a hold, handle the ball too much. So them things like that, you have to kind of take that into consideration when you're talking about it. Like right now, he's not ready. It's not to say Molly, he might not be, he might be ready two years from now. He might be. But right now, he's not ready to take over the reins of being, you know, the top player or the the guy who needs the ball in his hands to no. To be the intricate part of the offense, that this, AJ Dow, this would be a correct statement. He's a uh, Amon is a better defensive player at the current moment than Jalen Green. Yes, absolutely, That's absolutely, That's absolutely. That's, That's a fact. fact. Nigga, MA said Green <laughs> and, 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 and Steve, MA said it already, bro. Amon is elite wing defender in the NBA, not on our That's team, bro. Yeah, yeah, MA said that shit in the NBA, bro. Okay. Yeah, not you know what? Obvious. You talking about the? I got you know. I got a statement for it. NBA. A man is you not so? ready. A man is not ready to make other players better, even though he right. hell of a ball player. That's a good. That's a good. That's a good statement. Hey, that's a good statement. Hey, real quick, fellas. Real quick, fellas. Miss V, what you got, Miss V? What's up, Miss V? Uh oh. Hey guys. Um, how y'all oh, doing? There she go. There hey, she goes. Yeah, you can you hear me? Got yeah. that mic right. She got, she got it right. right. She got it right. <laughs> hey, it's just called sitting in the car. You know, I had to hang out with my people that came in for a little while. So now I'm in my oh, car yeah. after I dropped them off at home, uh, at the hotel. Yes, that's what's up. <laughs> hey, Ms. V, what I, you got I, on the What you got talk? on Jada's performance and hey. you know, everything of that nature? I'm going to start with this first. Team win. Team will. Everybody did their part. And and y'all have to forgive me. I'm getting feedback. So sometimes I stop because I'm thinking you're talking to me, but I realize that's just the feedback. Um, but no, I love the good. game itself. I, I um I love the game. It was a team game. What people fail to realize sometimes is that. Yeah, I hear people talking about Trey Jalen, but I don't think that this team is going to be that great with uh, somebody that can't, that doesn't have uh, the opposite, the uh, opponent game planning for that player. Because I don't care how bad he's shooting, they're always going to have the best defender on them, which opens up the, in the interior game. Um, I mean, it is just, that is a team game today. This, this was a team win. Everybody did their part. 
I mean, I'm just being patient because I love this, the way they're playing now. They're figuring it out. The young guys are figuring this thing out. And now they're working hard to try to see if they can get in the play in. That is what you wanted to see to begin with. Still there, Miss V? Still there? Yeah, y'all can't hear me? Oh yeah, we can. We can. Oh no, we hear you. We just no, let yeah, you cook. I, Go ahead. <laughs> yeah, we letting you cook. We got you. Got the flow, mom. You cooking? Oh no, I told you I'm hearing feedback, so I don't know. It just could be my weak speaker. <laughs> so I love what J Dog said about everything that I'm thinking about. I've listened to everybody. I mean, it's okay to have your favorite player on this team, but everybody mm -hmm. needs to understand. If you're a Rocket fan, you need to be rooting for every player. You're I'm worried already. about who gonna get the Thanks. max contract and all that. Who needs to worry about that? Those I'm not. I don't care. I'm not spending their money. That's not my money to spend. <laughs> but I can guarantee you, Jalen is gonna get what he gonna get because he was put in a situation where the last two years he was gonna look like he was selfish. But this mm -hmm. year, it looks like he's not selfish. He's trying to do the things that his coach is asking him to do. He's playing defense, and I told you that was going to – I told you he was going to look better you said, when mm -hmm. – You said you I told said, you at the end of the year he's going to look better. It has – defense is a hard game to play when you've never had to do it. Offensively, right. it's easy. But you defensively, you when you put that effort in, you got to get his legs yeah. under him. Javon hey, you know is what? going through the same thing. Hey, you know what, Ms. B, you are absolutely right. And you know what? A woman is going to make sure that Jalen going to get every bit of that max this offseason. So salute yeah, to the women. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Wait, wait, wait. No, no, y'all good. Let the, let the man talk. You know what? That young man handling his business on his own. He don't need no woman to do that for him. Maybe some men, maybe. Mm, I don't know. I don't know if mm. you're telling me about yourself, but this young man is doing his business. Okay? <laughs> oh, you know, if I hear the song, we fun. this is we the fun I right now. Fun right now. Yeah, yeah. Right? Yeah. Listen, yeah. Listen, I listen. If I had a son, I got a daughter, so I have to handle her and tell her to handle her business a certain way. But mm -hmm. this young man is his business a certain way. His job is to play basketball. Basketball is a game in which you get paid millions of dollars. He's been learning how to play this game for a long time and learning how to make money from this game, from his talent. Now he's learning how to be an overall player. Offense, defense, play the team concept. That is going to allow him to make more money. He understands that. Now, if everybody else who's a fan of somebody else understands that this is the player you need on your team to help your team get to the next level. It's not about Oh, I love Al P because I love Al P too. But Al P has been a professional since he was 15 years old. So he's supposed to be where he is. But he is a Big center. Fans. A center with no competition because the only best centers are about five of them before him. Uh, he's supposed I to be four. efficient. He's, I'm giving him five just because I just want to make it sound good. <laughs> but, <laughs> but if he's shooting 70%, Efficiency, he's supposed to, his ass is in the paint. But when you're a guard, you got to play outside, you got to play inside, you got to get other people involved. That is more taxing, and it's not all about offense, it's about defense. The brother had how many blocks today? Two, three, I don't know. I stopped watching, I had to go play with my family for a little while. So I'm gonna be through now and let listen for a little while. Who's around that That's a good take. That's a good take. Mr. Turned up. Good, damn good it's take. always good to have a female's perspective. Yeah, real talk. Nah, man, but but nah, but she nah, she absolutely right, bro. And she said Miss B was on that man early this season. He learned how to play defense. He learned how to get his teammates involved. It's gonna take a little time, bro, to get those legs up under you. Because now you're playing on both sides of the ball, and that shit is taxing. And, and you see it, bro. Jalen got Jalen got that freedom back in this game. He got a bounce yeah, back in the step. How did how, 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 how I look against, like, uh, let me say, mm -hmm. every, all the two guards that you look at that everybody say, oh, we should trade him for, how he look against them, those type of guys? You know what I'm saying? Bro, Jalen, only, only, only guard, bro, I think 
com comparable to Jalen, bro, right now, to me, the way Jalen play is, is is Anthony Edwards, bro. Like, I, you could say Shay or whatever, but Jalen is dynamic, bro. Shay, Shay scold around and Shay do good things, but, bro, talent wise, Jalen is, is, is talent wise, can't nobody dispute Jalen the Bill of Talent and Shay. Shay just get everything out of his, out of what he is, bro. He get everything out of he, he squeeze it. But he squeezed the turn. He get everything out of what he is yeah. as a player. But yeah. boys, you talking about you, talent level. wise? Talent yeah. wise, bro. I, I would on, say. Bro. Hold on, hold on, hold on. No, go ahead. Bro. You got it. You got it. Go ahead. You got it. Let me finish. I'm, I'm almost finished, bro. Jalen, bro, is a more dynamic talent because he's explosive. He can get to the rack. He can get his teammates involved, and he can shoot it when he when he's on. Like so. So what I say about that. Only, only guard in the league, bro, that I'll say that's just on that type of level that's explosive like that and they can shoot it when they get hot and and, and still, you know, get their teammates involved. Probably Anthony Edwards, bro. The rest of these guys ain't that – ain't. They might be could shoot it, but they can't. They not explosive. If they if they if if they explosive, they can't get their teammates involved. So it's a lot of intricate parts when it comes to being a dynamic guard that Jalen brings to the table that a lot of these other two guards don't do. Green. All right. So you know what? No, here's what yeah. I say about here's what I say about that. I mean, the thing is we had a guard around here for 10 years, right? And he was not the most athletic in the league. We all agree with that. He was a bad but boy. He, but 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 he was crafty as fuck, kind of like SGA. Now they comparing like You're everybody crafty. in the league. I mean, all the announcers, they ever can't compare James Harden to Kobe and MJ, right? I was too. Even though yes. he wasn't that athletic. So while we saying, yeah, we know that uh uh SGA don't have a bounce like Jalen got, I'm just saying what he make up with with craftiness and things like that, yes, he's like leaps and bounds ahead, and we can look at his team and see where they are above like uh, Jalen or whatnot. So I don't need all the bounce. I yeah, get it. Jalen, he got that bounce. Let me let me get my take, Green. Okay, gotcha. I'm going to say this. Hey, y'all get y'all screen recorders out. This going to be a hot take. Jalen Green, and they, and they don't play the same position. Jalen Green is comparable to Ja Morant, bro. Yeah. We know that. Why? why? Give you points. Why? Give you points. Why? Give you points. He's explosive. He's quick. He got that streaky three. He can get to the rim. Only thing I wish is that Jalen was as aggressive at dunking at the rim as John Moran. But other than that, when I watch them two play, they play similar, bro. It's, it's, it's just John Moran is a little bit more fearless than Jalen, but Jalen got the size above John. Do you remember? Do you remember last year? Jalen was unbelievably fearless going to the rim. He tried to dunk on everybody. You right. He tried right. to dunk on King Kong one game. Come on, You're bro. Right. It's oh, this yeah. year. They, he had to bag it up. You can't they, be, you know, so so reckless and and you know he played with reckless right. abandon last year. Last year, right. man. You right. I mean, the dude was shoot shots, bad shots. That's the difference in today's uh, Jalen Green. He shot a lot of missed shots last year, bro, but he also hit a lot of them, too. That's why his mm -hmm. scoring average was so high. But this different, it's different Jalen Green. He's not taking bad shots like he used to. He's just mm -hmm. not making them as, 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 as we would like him to, you know. But, like, he's gotten a whole lot better. But do I mean, you think, that's, do you think that's a good shots, comparison, Big shots. Steve? You think that's uh -huh. a good comparison? You think that's a good Play comparison, Jalen and Ja. Yes. Yeah, yeah, Why yeah. Why we need to That's compare them? That's a good one. No, nah, we not, we not, Miss V. I'm just saying, far as if you look at this player, look at this player. You're saying similarities, right? Similarity, yeah, right. Players that he's most similarities, yes. And Jaylen but you got to be smart as a, as a, a t aggressive player. Ja Moran yeah. stays hurt. Right, <laughs> you so Jalen is be, learning yeah. that I can be aggressive, but I also need to be available. Right. There yes. is a difference. I like that. And so, and so, yes. But even with that, you have to, even as a, as an aggressive or, or, or explosive player, you still have to learn how to do the other things because you can get hurt. Mm -hmm. 
lower leg injuries are, are prevalent. And so yeah, now we, you got to learn how to do the other things. And so he's yeah, young called, and I get it. Yeah, it's called. But, 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 but John don't play defense. That's why I said Anthony Edwards, bro. And that's another Anthony Edwards tries to play defense. John don't play defense. Anthony Jaylen, Edwards is a beast. He's a beast, right? You know, he, he he's he's got he's getting all three three points of uh his game is down, bro. He he's getting his teammates involved. He's playing defense and he, he's able to score the ball. You know, I mean, from the mid range, from from at the rim, and from the three. So that's that's what Ma trying to make Jalen out to be, and that's what Jalen is, is is coming into his own and 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 and, and being. That's why I say John Morant can. John ja, ja Morant is, is a good is a good uh athletic uh uh, uh comparable uh if you want to say that but for us you know what I'm saying the size and then and when you're talking about you know playing defense get his teammates involved and all that type of stuff like I think I think Anthony Edwards bro might be a little bit more comparable than Ja as far as you know the what they bring to the game and they ain't taking nothing from John ja Morant but y'all ja don't play defense bro you don't play. Nah, I like I, I like AE too, J Dog. I don't. I don't mm -hmm. Hey, both of them good to me. I like AE too. Mm -hmm. But I I believe this, J Dog. I believe that Jalen is a budding star, bro. I I I, I maybe you know I jump out the window, J Dog, and it may be the repasada, homie. But <laughs> I'm going off nine game, bro, of seeing explosive play on the defensive end. He's passing the ball. He rebounding the ball. And like the commentator said tonight, when he take that first step, bro, ain't nobody in the league can keep it. stay in front of that nah, man, bro. Nobody, bro. He's too quick. He's athletic. He can jump. That shot is falling now, bro. He getting to his mid range, J Dog. Yeah, it's scary, bro. It's scary. But, but you know what? I'm happy the one to be thing, a rocket, my nigga. The one thing he not getting no. That he has to earn is that respect because he's not nearly getting the foul calls he should get. At the cup. Hey, hey, yeah, hey, come, but it's coming, Larry. Hey, Larry. Hey, Larry. Let me ask you. You say no respect. Is he not getting it from the refs? Because he's getting it from the opponent. No, There's I'm saying he's not getting it from the. the refs, he's not getting it from the refs. It, but my, it's not, okay. He, but he getting it from the opponent. Because the whole freaking game, the damn Cavaliers players, it wasn't George Yang, if it wasn't Tristan Thompson, if it wasn't <laughs> I, somebody else, they was all giving the I, juice, I, and he just kept you, coming you know, back at them. So there's, as a player, I'm just telling you, as a player, it doesn't matter about the ref. It's about your opponent. It's about you know your, what, your peers. You know That's what, where B, it I, counts. Miss B, I was watching the game with my homegirl, right? And we were talking because she hooped, right? And the thing is, it was like, what Jalen need, I mean, the thing is, I don't like all this, like, salacious stuff at, at Jalen head, right? I mean, but he brought it on himself, right? But it's going to make it. Let me finish. Let me finish. Let me finish. Let me finish. Hold up. Let me finish. But the thing is, his name is out there. But his name is out there now, right? And it might be good for the Rockets now his name is out there. So now, bro, go at the cup. I mean, don't go like Ja, like y'all just said. Don't go like regulars of band and trying to dunk on everybody. Fuck it, me messing up your wrist and messing up your ankle and missing 18 games here and three games here. Don't do that. But just go up strong, bro, and let everybody know. Because everybody know right now who you are, bro. America knows who you are. You got people following your story, your stat line, and all that, bro. This is Jalen Green time to jump. You need to get that respect from the refs and get them foul calls. Because you know what? At 25 points a game we was asking for, it might be 27, 28 next year, dog, because he getting them foul calls. And, hey, hey bro, Jalen, take advantage of it, dog. Your name out oh. there, bro. I mean, you a household name that everybody, for whatever reason, step your game and up, the bro. Nigga, the nigga, the nigga Jalen should take this opportunity to do that because John Moran not even playing. Yeah, you should yeah. be one step in front of him. John Moran, not lead. even a two guard, he's, he's a point guard, right? You're right, right. you're right, right, Green. I, I believe it's a little different for him. He's learning how to win, so that's right. He's got a coach yeah, that's right. teaching him how to win, tell him what he needs to do to win, which is defense. The first thing out of Jalen's mouth when they talk to him is, Yeah, the defense stepped up. So, what that tells me is he's getting an understanding of what wins games defense. So when you get a guard, a person, I'm just going to put a ball player, 
who hasn't focused on defense like that, and he's young. That's why you have to get him young. And now he's saying the first time, yes, yeah, defense. We play defense, and we stop some people. That's his first thing out of his mouth. It's not about oh, when he took the dude off the off the uh, crossover and, and and looked at him when he fell down and sh shot the ball while he was doing the Steph Curve and running down the court before he went through the through the nest. The first thing out of his mouth that? was defense. Are you defense. seeing that, Miss I, I do see that. That's my point. Yeah, I get nice. that. The, I get that the LP fans and I love LP, but believe me, basketball is not about one player. It's about everybody. LP but is gonna help the team because he's a big man that can do his thing in the paint. Jay is gonna help. Uh, uh, Jabbar is gonna help. Tari's gonna help. Cam's gonna help. The whole team. It's not one player. That's why I hate when I hear. Hey, Miss oh, B, Miss B, Jaylen, Miss B. Because hey, I Miss B, they, hold up, Miss B, Miss B, yes. Miss B. They, they yes. all ain't gonna make it, Miss B. They all ain't gonna make no, it, and we gotta understand. Show, man, bro. There you go, <laughs> being negative, man. Man. No, no, I'm not now. being negative, but but the history no, tells us they all ain't gonna make it. Hey, he's worried about the doomsday scenario of Post enjoying the moment. No, I'm not. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Wait a minute. Let Enjoy me get this point. Hold on. Hold on. Wait. Hold on. With these let, 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 hold on. Let, how to win. All right, let me get this point you off. Gotta enjoy One the thing moment, we do know, dude. the only time in NBA oh history God. this talent has ever been together, mm -hmm. we had KD, Harden, Serge Ibaka, uh, <laughs> all them dudes over there. Young man. They ain't going to keep up. Man, look. Look, I'm calling you young because you're probably younger than me. I hope it's a Golden so State 20. I hope man. it's a Golden State. Young I hope, man. Basketball I hope is we have a Golden State 2011, now. 2012. Oh, my God. Oh, Miss V. Do y'all yes, think we have a go to say 2012, 20? Hold up, Do y'all think we have a go to say 2011, 2012 on this team right now? I you think we're Miami again. Heat. I want a Houston Rockets 2024. I want Houston 2024. Jane Posey. I think we got enough money to pay them just like Miami Heat paid all them folks. Well, let's do it hey, then. You talking about Laro? Us, hey, Mr. Laro, I understand your concern. I'm going to just put it like that. I'm going to understand your concern. But as a ball player, as a fan of basketball, I'm going to enjoy the Rockets team as it's constructed <laughs> at this moment. That's right. Because I don't see no 2012 or 2010 if you allow yourself to get caught up in your feelings, you're gonna let a player go that's gonna go somewhere else and take them to the championship. Know I just want to get back so to winning. I just want to get back out. to winning. You I just want to get back to winning. The process. You can't rush the process. You, you, said, you said, If you want to win, you should have talked to James Harden, right not to leave. What are you saying? You can't do you that. that uh, you just Shane gotta let the injuries make a difference. Let roll. Jalen has played every game of this season. Who else had on this team? Lero, you ever you seen have the movie to let Life? the process take its place. You can't rush you seen, that. You seen the movie Life, Lero? When uh, when when Ray was talking about the boom boom room, and then everybody butted in and said, "Oh man, shut up! We want to hear about this." That we telling you right now. Shut your motherfucking ass up being negative. Nigga, we gonna keep everybody. We gonna keep Barry. We gonna keep Tari. We gonna keep Almond. We gonna keep Cam. We gonna keep Alp. We gonna keep Jay. We gonna keep every motherfucker. Shut your ass up, negative Nancy. All right, cool. No, All right, so you know what? Hold on. Here we go. Here we just go. You know what? All right, hold on. Hold on. Let me get y'all. All right, so we got a super team coming in twenty twenty six, dog. Oh my. All right, cool. All right, cool. Super Team 26, 2026 Rockets, dog. Oh, LP, my God, Kat, dude. I mean. Listen, do you ever live in the moment that you live in? This is all I we're love saying. the fact that we. As a yeah, ball player, hey, Ms. B, you never Ms. B, go beyond the moment you're living in. Yes, you Ms. B, gonna, you want to do great Ms. B, things. I'm in the moment. But you ain't a I would ball love player. to you make the play in, bro. Enjoy the moment as a fan. I want to make the play in. That's my moment right now. My God, Playing. you better just okay, enjoy the, the moment. Listen, we if it happens, it happens. If they don't make the plan, is it a bad season? That's the question you need to ask yourself. No, if no, it's not a bad make season. The plan, I did they would have like a to make the plan. Season? But you know I what? Too, I, but in the but end, you know I'm going to enjoy the process. I just want to oh, win eight you know more games. Hold up. I just want to win eight more games so my prediction could be true, at least on something, that we can win 40 games this year. You understand me? That's all I want, Lero. You did? Hey, on, man, man, as a as an H-Town as a fan, bro, I saw when the uh, – 
when our beloved Astros went through it for like five seasons, dog, the worst team in the league. All of a sudden, and now they would. I, 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 hey, bro, I, I saw it. It must be we all saw it. I mean, so I, I can like take yeah, it I got to for go a little, little while, good. but all that losing it, it takes a toll made. on you. It takes a toll. All that losing. Listen, I mean, we won. I play sports. I've been in the ups and the downs. I get what you're coming from, but think about the players who has to have to do the job. So I'm a fan. That's why I can look at it a little differently than you, because I understand it's no, a I don't process. Have, I don't have sympathy it's for me in there. So listen, uh, no, what I mean by that, don't get caught up in your feelings because basketball is a process. And you got how many how many young players you got on your team right now? You like got eight, six nine, players like you tell eight, me about, eight. right? We got eight. We got you, eight. Y'all expected just because they brought four veterans in. That that was gonna help them jump jump over everything else. Basketball, you can't cheat the game. The game will never be cheated. That's what I'm telling you. You have they have to learn how to win. The same thing Oklahoma City went through. Houston's got to go through that. Ms. You Lee can't cheat. You, you that, can't bro. cheat steps. You can't. Uh, it's not that way. When you win, you win because you put the work in. You had to go through the hard times. You had to go through what Jalen went through. I had to go through. Everybody looking at me to be the star, but I'm struggling. I got a new coach. I got I got to learn how to do this differently. I got to learn how to play with my teammates. I got to help everybody else be better before I can be better. You got to learn the steps to winning the game of bas- any sport, any in life. In life, it's a step. You can't do that. Thanks. So when you tell me Thanks. you want, you tired of losing, I get it. But if you're a fan of the Rockets team that has decided we're not going to take the short step that Daryl Morey took by bringing in these players and we just mediocre, we get into the second round, we get maybe one or two times, we might make it to the conference final, but the the Warriors were better than us. We're never going to beat them until we can get our shit together and we don't have the the star player to do that because he don't want to play defense. So... Now you have to, you're doing that now. The step is there. You just got to be patient. The same way you was patient with the Astros. I enjoyed the Astros. I got to go sit in the best boxes, the suites in the, in, in the building. Very and, you know, Very that cheap. was it. You know what I'm yes. saying? I got to go. I hey, had to pay for nothing. I was getting in there. So my thing is, we don't have that anymore. Hey, Stop so trying y'all to know rush the process, hold up, dude. Miss B, Miss B, yes, all sir. y'all don't know what I'm talking No, no, no. No, he good. We, 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 hold on, hold on. Talk. Talk. Y'all are talking to uh, like uh, Jack Yates Royalty right now. I know Miss B. Like Miss B don't know me, but I know Miss B. You talking to Jack you Yates Royalty me. right now? <laughs> I mean, I, I, no, Ms. you B, don't know me. Miss B, I'm no, not sir, gonna start dropping names basketball. on YouTube right now, but Miss Miss B. I know you a Jack Yates royalty right now, so I, I'm gonna chill out. So I mean, you you are a legend. I mean, real dog. I mean, so I'm, I'm a not legend. a legend. I'm nothing like that. I'm just a ball player. That's all. I just love basketball, and so I love to see young people do their thing. But you can't you can't rush that process, and y'all gotta stop putting one player down so you can see another player on the same team shine. They're all players. When when right. Alfie got hurt. Jalen was by his side the whole entire time, helping him into that wheelchair, cheering for him to get better. This team, if you don't understand what a team is, you got to go through the struggles. You got to go through all that. But they're getting there. I understand you want to see them win, and they're going to get there. But you cannot try out trade Jalen. For what? Because he inconsistent. Damn, a shooting guard never going. He's not a scorer. He's, he's a scorer. He's not a shooter. Most guards are not going to be efficient. They're going to have moments where they're just going to go 30 for whatever. He ain't shooting 30 points because his coach is not going to let him do that. But my point is, cheer the players that's on your team. If Jaden is in, in L.A. Lakers, then you can but, boo him. But we got to call him out when he's when he doing bad, right? Yes, you should. You should. All but right, you don't call out right, everybody. Sir. You don't call out everybody. LP had no, bad I- game, turned the ball over five times down the court. Where he trying to beat a double trim or a triple trim instead of passing the ball out, but you don't do that. Mm-hmm. Be consistent. Every, every I'm, not a, of, I'm not a fan of Jalen. Like I'm a fan of the Rockets. Damn, 
It seemed like every goddamn post game show we was he, even right. a, a win or a loss, it end up Jalen Green something. It's it's Jalen Green. It's it's his fault because they his got fault. scared. Jalen started no, looking good. No, it's because we have expe- we have no. expectations no. of him, dog. No. He was the he number two pick overall for the whole team, bro. <laughs> He, the whole team. Hey. We got expectations for all of them, not just him. A team, a basketball team does not win by one player or lose by one player. It lose by five of them that's on the court at one time and the other five or six that come off the bench. Jordan was the greatest player of all time, but I guarantee you during them finals appearances, there were certain players that came up in certain games that won them those games. Jordan did what he did, but it's also, like I say, it were players that came through in the clutch. That's what you need. You don't need to be the superstar. Steve Kerr. Hello. Scottie Pippen. Dennis Rodman no, getting not that Scottie, rebound. Oh, I mean, it's a, it's a Tony down. Kuko. What was your name? It was another one. Yeah, Tony Kuko, Horace Grant. I mean, I watched all these games. And the Detroit Pistons with Isaiah Thomas and his crew was not even, I mean, if once you know what real basketball is like, then you understand what this easy shit is. Just enjoy that trip. The rock so is gonna B. be okay. Oh, hold on, hold on. So, Miss B, are you, are you trying oh to say God. three and D basketball is easy right now? <laughs> no, I'm not saying that. But you're the one who can seem to think that there's one mm-hmm. player that controls whether they win or lose, and it's not. Okay, Jalen Green is cool. one player. Jalen Green is gonna have his struggle, just like Al P will, just like Jabari will, just like Fred will, just like Dylan will, just like Army will, just like Cam will. It's a game. Nice when one player is not playing well, that's why the other players need to step up. It's not just when one gets hurt. It's when so one can't hit a bucket. You so gotta still keep. Hey, yes, sir. So, Miss B, if you had one question to ask Greenleaf about the Rockets right now, what would you ask him? I don't know. He has the same mindset I have. So I don't have no question for him. You think my so? question right. would be for you. Man, this nigga my question would be for you. I mean, I'm just my asking if we're chilling, bro. We're chilling, bro. Are chillin'. you a Rockets fan? No, 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 yeah, yeah. She on my team, No, li- listen. I'm, I'm on your team, too, too nigga. What the fuck you talking about? Are you a Rockets fan? I'm on the squad, too, bro. A true Listen, are you a true Rockets fan? Meaning, I understand you want to win, but you do understand you have young players on your team, right? They're learning to win. Did you just told me you? I heard well, you talk me. for the last few streams. Yes, that's what I was trying to tell Arrow all season long. Like, like we could point out the little simplematic, you know, faults of him, but he's a young dude who have no structure, and now the emails coming along, like. <laughs> I didn't. I, I said twenty five, five and five because that was like my highest expectation because I know the type of player Jalen Green can be. Keep but that. Keep that thought. With that. With that. With keep that. Uh. With the what, what it made you dope was presenting for this young group, saying like, "Hey, bro, ain't nobody spot solidified. You got to prove yourself." And and ain't nobody guaranteed to get that because he made in his in the athletics. Mm-hmm. Athletics in his interview with the athletics, he even talked about it's not about one player going out for 20 every game. It's about a team concept. And so if a team concept is a, the moment, yes, Jalen can do what he can do. He can get 25, but this is the team concept if hey, the Ms. coach B. is doing something else. Hey, Ms. B, in, in yes, that sir. same interview, in that same interview, he may say that anybody in the NBA can score 25 uh, points a game if right. they had unlimited shots. play something else, yeah, right? I, Ms. Yeah, B it said goes that. Back to, <laughs> yeah, it goes, that yeah. goes back to everybody right. want to play Jalen Green. So, it goes right. back to everybody want to trade Jalen Green for like Donovan Mitchell, Zach Levine, and Jalen right. Brown. You and all Donovan these Tell me what Donovan did on defense. Nothing. Jalen Green just had two blocks on his man one on one. Come on, Say man. Green. Come on, dude. Green. Y'all you gotta understand. Too, you went too far yeah. off for that 25, 5, and 5, bro. He done did That's it. That's what I'm saying. He's there. He I mean, I, mean like, like, like the I know what I see, but at hey. the same time, bro, he didn't come out like that because Jaden was shit in the bed, but then now he the pappy now, so you know he's dealing with some off-court issues. Yeah, uh, that's y'all, y'all, y'all looking at it wrong. Like y'all that. looking at – hey, I looked at it differently. I looked at it as a player that only knew offense, right? Mm-hmm. I looked at it as a player that only played offense. Now he has a coach that has some structure, and my structure is you need to play defense if you want to be on the court. 
Mm-hmm. But Miss B, so now he got a baby mama. Listen. He got to provide for it, though. Dude, you that, know that, what? He got you got a baby mama. Do you have a baby mama? Do you have yeah, a baby yeah. mama? Do you have a baby mom? I, I got two. I got two. I got two. That don't have nothing to do with baby mom. You should know, nigga. Listen, you I'm a female, then, so I heard everything yeah. y'all talk about that woman, and hey, I don't understand the concept because that don't mean nothing to me. Yeah, that's right. 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 Yeah, that's but uh, he Larrow just said that shit. You don't think? Hold on, Big You don't feel like that? Come on, bro. He's balling like that. All right, cool. Bro, bro, bro. Is this show? I want to ask this real quick. You don't think that Jalen Green was 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 you know, she wasn't putting that thing on him and draining his energy and nothing like that <laughs> for him to perform and like night basis. Oh, he's young, dude. He's young. He's young. He's young. He young. I don't give a hell shit to do with it. Now, what you putting stress so... on him? Maybe, hey, I'm going to just keep it on the basketball level. I don't know what the young man's personal life is. I don't know. <laughs> yeah. But I do know that as a basketball player, I've never been an offensive player in the beginning. I started playing basketball as a defensive player because I ran track first. So for me, it's easy for me to stay in front of you. So I was able to bruh, play defense. Bruh, bruh, the sisterhood, the but, sisterhood gonna yeah, stand yeah, together yeah, regardless. Yeah, 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 I'm a little older than that woman as well. And as I just said, young guys will come at you, and I'm saying that as experience. In a certain way. But for me, you're the same as just my kid, and that's just not my mentality. I'm a man, I, I, I mean, now don't get me wrong, there are guys my age more immature, probably more immature than some of them young guys. So I'm not mm-hmm. like that. My theory is this I know who I am as a woman, first and foremost. So all that other stuff has nothing to do with it. Y'all get caught up in that. That's that young man's personal business. I don't care about that. I just don't understand how she got caught up, but that again, not in my moment. She, well, hey, she's Ms. a B, different person. How did M- Miss B? Hold up. Uh, hold on, how hold did on, she me... get? I oh, know. Hold up, Miss B. How did she I get caught know, up? I don't know her. The man got caught up. Jalen got caught up. You saying man, she got no, caught up? They both I said she. Adults, man. They both. They are both adults. considered now, adults. Both of let them. Me, let me address Big Damn. Steve. Let me address Big Steve's <laughs> point about that they ain't got nothing to do with it. Big Steve. It has nothing to do with it. Now, I'm going to speak for me. I ain't going to speak for you. But when I got my wife and we started having children, I knew I had to stop working at Burger King and I had to get an oil field. Hey, Jalen Green, he got to stop playing bad and he got to start playing better. He got two people to provide for and he needs that max contract, Big Steve. That's all I'm going to say about that. Yeah. Well, I'm gonna say this. So he's he no, you know, you know what? We are not finna allow, man. You know what, Green? We are not about to finna allow this happen, bro. Jalen Green, look, man, we are not gonna, man. Look, you know what? This is not this. Hey, about this dream. Hey, the Bible says, when I became a man, I put away my childish things. Now, he has a child on the way. So, yes, that should mature him much more. It should become to his manhood uh, strongly, more strongly. But uh, as far as his game, his game, basketball game, that has zero to do with his basketball game, bro. Because whatever Thank he got you, in his basketball somebody. game, if he's not developing it, if it's not already there, it will not be there. Plain well, simple. Steve, baby, oh, yeah. baby, baby, his basketball game is his job, Big Steve. Baby, baby's you know, like that you I know, Big Steve. If you don't, you got if a you kid coming, crap. you're going to work overtime. You you're going to work a little time, harder. I want to tell you. I Oh. Listen, brother, if you don't perfect your craft, I don't give a damn how many baby mamas and babies you got. You won't be shit. So okay, miss me with the baby mama shit, so bro, because that has zero to do with it, bro. Big Steve, that's why I'm saying when he know he finna had his baby and a baby mama, like I said, like us regular folk, we work a nine to five. We know we got a kid coming. We gonna pull overtime, double time. We gonna work hard. He ain't got to He ain't got to do that, bro. Oh, look. Yeah, he do. Cause he playing. No, for he a don't. Contract. He, he ain't, ain't got to do that. Okay. If he played bad like he Bro, right now he got enough year, money. He right now he got enough right. money for his baby's lifetime, his baby's baby lifetime. Bro, so miss me. Bro. bro, uh 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 what's the sick Lou Williams just said he broke. And we I, I I bet you thought he had enough money for his kids and grandkids and kids, grandkids, and all that. He said he broke. 
So we know how this. This could goes. be a lesson to Jalen to stop raw dogging right, right now. And and it could be a lesson to stop raw dogging like that. Real life situations happen in everybody's life to make them. Think well, it, it, man, if y'all can't that, stop man, feeling that fucking goddamn flesh, I mean, can no, can no, he stop raw? Got can can he stop raw dogging now? No, you ain't got to do that. You ain't got to stop it now. No, you ain't got to do that. You just got to work harder to provide. Y'all doing family. too much. Man, come you on. You doing too much. It's called basketball, basketball you challenge, come right? On, dog. He, everybody already agree he got got once. So if you can't stop hey, raw dog after one, about about that means you just can't. I mean, you just want to live nasty, dog. And you want to raw dog all your life, man. You might get some. Hold on. Hold on. Hold on. People live their life, but it's just called basketball, right? Talking about basketball, his personal life. Right. His so personal then, life so involves the basketball. Day, at the end of the day, Laro, like you said, bro, you already see Jalen Green on the roster going forward, averaging maybe twenty-seven, maybe next season because he got yep. the experience under Major Doka. All I want for this team is to make the play in, to have some taste of that blood, just like OKC did. You feel me? With the veterans that we have. They know, I know but, but, but Green, no, take this out. But Green, do you think if we get a taste of that blood in the first round, we can't take out OKC, bro? I think we could. If, yeah, we, yeah, if, we, we, fight for, if we fight for him, I think we could. Strange I things think we could. I think we could. Like they, like they, they, like we were just talking about. Do you believe we in OKC? It, what have they proven in the, in the first round matchup? What have they proven? At green, you just said a couple strings back, bro. Like I'll we get into the squad right, right now, we get in a nice groove at the end of the season, bro. Finish this season out with maybe one or two losses. Stranger things have happened. We get into that play in tournament here. We might just make the playoffs. Fuck the playoff tournament. Uh, no, we we'll get to the playoff spot and get in, in the first round. And, and like I say, we we in the click. We in the in the bucket like fish. Come on, bro. We can. I mean, stranger things have happened in the NBA. We might be in the groove at the right time and get the right team at the right time. As a lower seed, Houston Texans just won a playoff game as a lower right. seed. I know we a series, but it ain't too far fetched, bro. We can win a series. Yeah. And, and you know what? And what is be what has been always called as, as through history is called peaking at the right time. Exactly. Could be doing that, bro. It right. talks. We could be peaking at That's the right time, saying. dog. That's all I'm saying, bro. Hey, it up, ain't no Trina? way we should have lost to the Clippers, Hello? but we were coming off of Hello, back to salute, back. Salute, salute, you know what I'm saying? Salute, chat. Salute, salute. What's up, Papa Chill, man? Hey, we dust them boys today, bro. Hey, I ain't even watch. I I caught it uh the second half. I ain't even really watched the first half, so I don't really know how you know things. Was, yeah, you know, we dust them niggas. We dusted them niggas, man. I, I last time I heard somebody was worrying about the cows might be the one that we lose. And we end up dusting in them niggas. Yeah, 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 yeah. And so, tell, tell them motherfuckers stand on this shit, cuz. So, so what's, what's, what's that now? Like, what, what are we looking at? An A gamer? An A game win streak? I think we're we six out of the last eight. I think, no, we won seven <laughs> out of the last eight. Yeah, it's yeah. a seven or six. Seven out of the last eight. We said we seven and one. Okay. Well, we on okay. a five game winning streak. We ain't on no six or seven game winning streak. We on no, five game it's five. Streak. I think we won All six right, out of it, the last seven. It's six, eight, six out of the last eight games. Yeah, if we nah, had look, not, if, if we had not lost to the Clippers, we we'd be like uh, seven and zero. Oh. We on a five game winning streak, Big Steve. Look at yeah. the standings, okay. bro. Yeah, okay. we, yeah, we, we yeah, won yeah. two, lost one, and then we just won five. Yeah, yeah. we'd be seven and zero oh if we had not lost to the Clippers, bro. So yeah, we could, we good though. What man? What Golden State doing right now? Has the, has the Lakers play. game started oh, already? They they play. Play. They're, going they're, play. they're getting smashed. It's uh thirty-two to. Are they all right now? Yes, yeah, in the first quarter. All it's right, hey Green, go ahead and do your. You said you wanted to do national games, dog. Go and do the game, nigga. Yeah, 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 <laughs> hey, everybody, go hit the cash app and the super chip, man. Go and start your, your program, yeah. get national shit, dog. <laughs> hey, Lara, Lara, when I do it, I'm going to do it, bro. It might not be tonight, but I'm going to do it. I'm, I'll be paying attention, though, bro. I'll be paying attention, though, dog. Yeah, listen. We, we focusing on these H-Town Rockets right now, God damn it. Hey, yeah, hey, well, oh, it's a real deal spiel, bro. We we four hours strong, bro. You know what I'm saying? I appreciate everybody pulling up. Salute. I'm, I'm, I'm about to sit back and watch these games and, and listen to the stream here and there. 
this stream, sure, you know what I'm saying? Like, I listen to my own product. I don't listen to all the other Fairweather shit. Like right. I said, everybody else, all you other country crazy on this, you know what I'm saying, down Jalen Green to big up LP. But now you got to talk about Jalen Green and, and, and the rest of them. Stand on it, bro. Stand on it, man. Say yeah, green. Your views about hey, green. hey, real quick, Green, before you Hold up, hold up, hey, Papa Trill, real quick, Papa Trill, real Jaylen? quick. I got smoke for Green real quick. You need What's to start up? listening to your protege, bro. I'm over here cooking some shit, fam. Damn, you said, man. Say, say, say it again, now. I say you need to start listening to your protege over here, too, fam. I'm over here cooking, man. Oh, yeah, I listen. I listen. Yeah, I just don't be present. I mean, you might not see me present, but I listen. I listen. Nah, I listen. I'm fucking with you. You know what I'm saying? I already, yeah, man. Y'all you got you me up, man. You know, I'm on the rep side of bro. I'm finna go uh, try to eat it off. Uh, salute to everybody on the panel, man. You know, I fuck with you, boy, man. I already, man. Hey, y'all subscribe to the Prince, man. Y'all know who he is, the Prince 432. If you don't know, now you know, man. Y'all subscribe to him. Check him out. He do the pregame. Talk about the Rockets, Rockets, man. If you ain't gonna listen to nobody else with this full gaze of Rockets shit, man, rock with the squad that's producing Rockets content, man. Y'all go show some support, show some love to the Prince. You know what it is. 432. Uh, man, and once again, man, salute to all you guys that's on the panel. You know, uh, Big Steve, J out, Papa Trio pulled up lately, but it's out good. <laughs> I know, I know, I know he's been listening, uh, here and there. You know what I'm saying? He probably had a business behind the scenes, Miss V as well. Shout out to Miss V. She cooked the shit out of Laro ass, cooked the dog oh, shit out of his ass. Yeah, I'm finna go back as, as, as usual. <laughs> she always come over and cook that thing. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Boy, hey, it's yeah, all man. love. We all Rockets fans, right? <laughs> all right. Yeah, Just gotta keep it's your real. mind in all order. Hey, hey, most of all us, day, right? Every day, most of us, right? All, all day, right. every day, man. You still gotta check lateral goddamn Rockets card. <laughs> <laughs> every game, every stream, we need to check the nigga card. <laughs> I'm cool. Yeah, long as that motherfucking house ain't showing up. All right, green them out. <laughs> oh, yeah. <laughs> Shout out to you, Steve. Shout out to all y'all, man. Much love, much respect. Appreciate y'all pulling up. It's rocket or nothing. You feel me? Uh, But yeah, man, the mother streams coming too. The mother streams coming too. But the Rockets got some playoffs hopes, and I'm gonna rock out with it with the Rockets. I ain't finna switch up until they out the out for the count. You know what I'm saying? Uh, so that's what it is with me. Y'all pull up for the next stream. Appreciate the love, support once again. Hit that like button, subscribe. It is your boy Green. If exclusive, I'm out your fam. Peace. Hey. Thank you.